Okay, looks like it's recording. Welcome back, everybody. Welcome. So like I was just telling chat here, it's been a little bit since I got the chance to play this. I've really been looking forward to more. Last week was just really busy. We just started Chapter 7, and I've been really excited to see what happens next. So let's do it. I believe, yep, we walk over here. Cutscene. What do you got to tell me, old man? Say, was Duster with you? Yes. Why can I say no to that? I thought so, but I doubt there's any need to worry. I'll let Wes know. Lucas, if you've met one of my um, frog friends, they might not look like it, but they're trustworthy. They may be able to help you out. They gave me psychic powers last time. I'm sure he's fine. All right, then let's get going. Oh, are you all better now? Try not to be so reckless anymore, okay? I love how this is overflowing in the corner. Drip, drip, drip. What about you? Oh, Boney. Oh, and you too, Lucas. I'm here visiting Grandma. We play games like Pin the Tail and the Leak, Hide and Go Sweep, and the Hokey Pokey. Oh, getting you to do chores, huh? I love to play games with my granddaughter, especially Pin the Tail and the Leak, Hide and Go Sweep, and Hokey Pokey. Riveting dialogue. By the way, I realized something about this building that bothers me a lot, right? So look how, like, terrible and dilapidated it is. But do you guys remember that, like, this building didn't exist three years ago? Did they just, like, build it out of straw or something? Woof woof. What's that? Oh, somebody's woofing down there. Let's go see what this is about. I've been excited to get back to more of it, yeah. Over here? Uh, Duster? Oh wait, no, that's not Duster. That's one of the frog people. Stroke! Stroke! What? That old guy clearly has hobbies and interests different from regular people. Stroke, stroke. He smells like the forest. I think he should go back there. Hey, whoa! Dude? Okay. That was your problem. Strange, girlish, boyish, girlish person has been rolling around here all tied up. I don't know what to do, so I'm just standing here doing nothing. Asking for help, but the only thing I can think of is to stand her up. What should I do? Should I stand her up? Can I say something completely off topic? Sure? I picked up this doorknob the other day, but I was irritated at the time, so I threw it to the east as far as I could. I wound up dislocating my shoulder as a result. Actually, no, I was just fibbing about that last part. Haha. -ha. Okay, there's a doorknob somewhere east, apparently. If we cut her rope, she'll be free, right? But what if she goes crazy and hurts people? Y'all are just like, hmm. You good? Wah. Oh, I undid the gag on my own. I just moved my mouth up and down like so and slowly slipped it off. Ooh, I'm wonderful. I hate to be a bother, but could you stand me up? Door. Oh, thank you, darling. I don't know what happened. I was minding my own business, taking off my makeup, when suddenly I was physically attacked. Oh, what an unfabulous time to be attacked. Oh my. You're that boy I met at the hot spring the other day, aren't you? Seems the threads of fate have led us to each other again. From the moment I realized you could use PSI, I knew there was something between us. You're undoubtedly one of the frog people. Uh, you've been waiting for tens of thousands of years, right? Can you sense it too? Can you feel the time drawing near? It's okay if you can't. I'm not entirely sure about it either. Wait a second. If I was attacked, could it mean? Oh, I hope uh, Aeola is all right. I wish I could fly there, but I can't without my makeup on. All I can do is walk on land like a human. How tragic. Ooh, well, I'll walk if I have to. And you, you're coming with me. Come on, let's go to Eola's house, okay? Door? Marvelous. Let's make some magic happen. I mean that in a nice way. Yona joined the party. All right, good for them. We could reach Yola's house easily by going straight up the river, but... Hold on, you guys. I have no idea what you're talking about just now. But if it's up the river you need to go, then it's our time to shine. 
Come on, follow us. All right, boat game. Look at them do their swimming animations. Do they have um equipment slots? They do, but I can't equip anything to them, so they're temporary, I guess. Hold up. We just got to. We just love to row the boat. We used to be boatless, you see. We just got this. It's the greatest boat ever. You'll go on it, of course. Sure. Welcome, everybody. How y'all doing? I'm excited to play some of this, too. Um, the last episode had a little bit of copyright issues, so it took a few tries to get up. I was annoyed about that. So there ended up being a bit of a gap in episode times. Or, sorry, a bit of a gap between episodes three and four. But I got lots of um, stuff recorded the past week, and I wanted to focus on this now. See if I can get multiple sessions of it done next week. Yesterday, I did like four hours of Banjo. And I still have several hours worth of Yu-Gi-Oh! VODs to upload, too. It's been a pretty productive week, I gotta say. Yep, everything's closed. Welcome, everybody. How you doing? Does makeup let you, let you fly? Does that mean, like... Oh, so that's where goth girls get their power. We just love to row our boat. We love... Used to be boatless. Okay, same thing. Ribbit, ribbit. Ribbit, rabbit. Something's different about this one. Oh, this thing here. Working a new job today. Hope it goes well, friend. Okay, that's that, I suppose. What was the map button again? R button, right. Well, this is where we need to go. I'm glad they didn't make me go through the entire forest or something. Moo, in the mood for a milking? Uh, no thank you. Take it, you're not a milk person. It's not the best for my throat to have before streaming. I like that stopped me. That's this right here. I guess we can just heal right quick. <clears throat> Pardon me. Hydrate, don't mind if I do. Everyone's party is feeling good again. On that topic, though, chat, um, I posted about it online, on, on Twitter, I mean, but um, I actually made some cookies last night. After yesterday's stream, I got up ingredients and I spent my evening baking cookies and it felt nice. However, the cookies looked like crap, but they ended up tasting great. It was double dark chocolate chip. Hello, are you gonna help us? Oh, what happened? Why aren't you wearing any makeup, Iona? This is no time to be silly, Aeola. I was attacked, so I rushed here to see if you were alright. I'm just fine. I'm just as lovely as I always am. But never mind me. Why don't you untie that rope already? Hang on, I think the game audio is a little low. Oh, I was in such a rush, I never even noticed. What a shock. Lucas, could you untie me now? Unbelievable, you have no sense of courtesy. All right. Hot cocoa is nice, yes. Ah, who's that fine figure? Why, that's me without makeup. I'm sexy even without makeup on. Just one second. They're all done, I'm pretty again. Yuck. You can keep that lipstick. Indirect kisses with other girls aren't my thing. Oh, I have a bad feeling. What could it be? What could it be? What could it be? Uh-oh. Something evil's about to happen. Yep, there's a red flash on screen. That's the devil outside. Oh, it's like the third time this week. Yep, sounds like he's pissed, too. No, but really, what's happening? Everything even went lavender for a second. Last thing that happened before this, like the end of last episode, we grabbed on to, like, um... Uh, a ladder as a helicopter was taking us away, I think. And then we just... Oh. What's happening here? And then we fell into a pile of hay. Oh my, Yola, Your body... 
your body is starting to disappear. Oh my, oh my, oh my. So it is, it's disappearing. I'm disappearing, but I'm well. Well, at least they're positive about it. But does this mean... Hey, legendary sword of power. That would be pretty cool if I had that. The needle in Osohi Castle that I've protected for so long. Someone has pulled it. Someone able to pull the needles has finally appeared. The dark dragon sealed away by the seven needles will awaken. There's a lot to dump on me all of a, su all of a sudden. That table is floating. A secret, a secret area. This will be great. You can get to the courtyard of Osohi Castle through this underground path. If the needle really has been pulled, I will vanish ver very soon. But it would be wise to know who pulled it. Someone with a dark heart or someone with a light heart? The answer to that may change the fate of the world completely. Ooh, so today is the day I disappear. Iona, what's your name? And Doggy. Bye. Oh. Iola. You were an open-hearted person. That's why we got along so well. Oh dear. Okay. Let's follow this underground path to Osuhi Castle's courtyard. Perfect moment for me to be unable to talk. <clears throat> there we go. Received Eola's memento. And what does that do? Let me have a look at my items. Razor and lipstick. Okay. I guess I need it for something. No problem here. Anything else? Looking handsome. Hell yeah, I am. Nice vase. Rose hip tea? Okay. I think it's an automatic revive. Oh, look at the run animation. That's so nice. You encountered Cleocatra and its cohort. Alright, not bad. Let's get started. Cleocatra is basically that one Animal Crossing character, right? There we go. Hopping around. Come on. We did it! Mm, pardon me. Trying to talk mm, through my th uh, throat being a little sore all of a sudden. No, not sore, just a little bit, uh, gunky. Even weeks later, I still feel like my throat gotta recover a little bit, yeah. Let's fight him. You encountered a Cleocatra. Let's go. Batting her false eyelashes. Hypnosis Alpha. Don't do that. Okay, good. 285, and we'll take that. That's a really good level. I'll definitely want that right now. Hang on. Rotten Milk. Okay. That's not anything useful. Here, we can go ahead and use a PSI on this group. We don't have the full group, so we can't use, like, our best attacks all the time, I think. Just only Lucas can PSI is what I mean. Damn it. Missed it. Bony fell asleep. Perfect. Hypnosis Alpha. Oh, fantastic. At least my sweater re automatically recovers me. We'll do it just fine. Bony dodge quickly. 
This is okay. At least we get support heals, but uh, we can't move. This is all kinds of great, isn't it? <laughs> okay, Boney's awake. Lucas, please wake up. I'm begging you. Damn it. Please. Oh my goodness. Lucas, please, please. I'm begging you to hit something. Please land an attack. Damn it. No, please! Oh, come on. Come on. Oh, we're gonna be here all day, aren't we? We're gonna be here all day. Hang on a second, chat. I think I'm about to sneeze. I can feel it coming. I feel like my nose is itching. Come on. Okay, it was just... False alarm. Just like my chances of waking up in this battle. At least the music is a bop, yeah. And I would like to bop them. Lucas, wake up! This is worse than Pokemon sleep. And that's saying something. I can't- I have no rhythm right now. Lucas, please wake up. Lucas, please wake up. Okay. Now, attack them. Damn it. I haven't hit them once with Lucas. I can only poke them with Boney, and then Boney just falls asleep again. Okay, they're doing this. Do another PK Teddy. Come on. That won't save you. Cool, they're all healed again. Why? <laughs> Why does this keep going? <laughs> Please! Okay, one of them is at least beaten. What, why did this suddenly become a massive snooze fest, literally? Literally, what happened compared to the last fight, other than there being one more cat, of course? Mm-hmm. All right, then, get comfy, everybody. Let's go with a regular attack on Lucas now. Trying to spread damage is doing nothing. Because I can't do it fast enough because they keep putting me to sleep. Mm-hmm. Any day now. Come on. Come on. No! Cursor. Damn it! The cursor defaults to the center one. I was mashing A button preemptively. I'll let my frustration tilt me here. Okay, we're both awake. We're going to finish this now. Please. Oh! Can we please move on? Why? This enemy feels like it was designed for uh, gr groups larger than two. Damn it. Deserve crit, I guess. There we go. There we go. Do they even have? I got eight fifty-five for that. That's that was kind of worth it. Not really though. It's a lot, but still. <laughs> I can't believe that crap. I thought it was, like, too high of a level after last episode, too. Let's see if the beep jerky on you, I suppose. I'm sure we can do this, chat. Oh, that is a way down? Does that mean this is, too? No. I feel like this is supposed to... Yeah, it's a secret. Magic tart? Yeah, we'll take that. That was really bad sleep luck. Oh, I'm feverish. 
What a weird mechanic. You have to go slow to learn new moves. Because it makes you sick. The Teddies are cheering, that's right. Chat, did you know that the new Teddy Cheer emote is one of the most used emotes now? People love that one a lot. Thirteen hits. Get out of my sight. <sighs> mm-hmm. We killed one. We did it. We did it. You're next, buddy. Come on. The rhythm is returning to me. We can do this. Come on. What a great start to it, falling asleep and watching me rage at it. I shouldn't have tried to spread out the damage with PK Teddy. It seemed like a good idea, but I didn't expect the sleep to be that bad. Isn't it supposed to have, like, low accuracy, too? The hypnosis, I mean? Okay, let's have a look up here. Thank you, Stubborn Bolt Picks, for gifting the sub. I appreciate it. No problem here. Beaver went away. Defense up. So the needle really has been pulled. Hmm. I have absolutely no idea who pulled it. The dark dragon's heart will become as light or as dark as that person who pulls it. That's what it said anyway, but I don't sense anything here at all. I don't sense the heart of good or evil. How mysterious. Could there be a person in this world without hearts? I always assumed the Dark Dragon would stay sealed away for eternity. No, we still have a chance left. You were able to learn PK Teddy. Could it be that you're also able to... Oh, that's right! I haven't explained anything to you at all. I need to tell you about the needles. Yeah, we could use a little bit of exposition here. What are they? Alright. Behold, happy, wholesome land. First, know this. These are specially protected islands. We reside upon these islands together with a limitless power. That power is the dragon that sleeps in the darkness under the islands. The dragon is incredibly large, about as large as all the islands put together. Because the dragon is asleep, these islands are protected from disaster. But its powers is too great for humans to control. It was for this reason that our ancient frog ancestors placed seven needles in the dragon to make it sleep. One needle for each frog person. For a very, very long time, we have continued to guard the needles. But it has been told that someone to wake the dragon will appear when its power is needed. However, if the one who needs the dragon's power has a heart of evil, the power will obey all that is evil. It's very possible that everything could be completely destroyed simply to satisfy wicked ambition. On the other hand, the exact opposite is what we hope for. If a person with the heart of good pulls the dragon's needles and uses its powers, the fate of all evil will be washed away and all life as we know it will shine brightly. That's what's told. Finally, listen to this, but don't worry. When each of our seven needles are pulled, we frog people will cease to be. Our millennia-long lives over. Isn't that just romantic of us? Gotta find the seven MacGuffins now. Pulling back. Mm. I sneeze again. I'm okay, I swear. Cleocatra didn't want to make me okay, though. Uh-huh. Anything else? Do I gotta hit the button? No, it goes on its own. There's one other legend. It says only those with the power of PK Teddy can pull the seven needles. Oh, I wonder who could have done that then. 
Not even we frog people have that ability. In other words, you're able to pull the needles because you're a chosen boy. Oh, I wonder who the other chosen person could be. Anyways, maybe we should check out another one of those pig mask places where I somehow get mistaken for someone else. Hello? Who is this? C Commander, please hurry here. We've located the next needle, but, but, but the monkey, we need the monkey. The monkey can open it. Oh, what a pain in the neck. Anyway, the monkey's the key. I'll explain the details later. Please come to Chimera Lab. I assume you know where it is. Yeah, it was near um the the lift at the factory. Yeah. Ah, huh? Commander, your voice sounds kind of cheery today. Oh, I sound like someone else. I wonder how that's possible. Well, anyways, actually, to be honest, I'm having a hard time remembering myself. You take the crossroad train to the factory, and when you arrive, you go west from the ropeway station behind the factory, right? Yeah. Thank you. I'm heading to Chimera Lab right now. There's a monkey in trouble. And a needle. Please hurry and panic too, Commander. Beep. That was weird. How did I get mistaken for someone else again? Can't talk to you? There we go. What's up? That ladder's a shortcut back to Tazmili. Head there. I'm worried about my own needle now. I'll just know we'll meet again, but if we don't, that means one of us has left this world. Giggle. Bye bye You could do that? Well, I guess you didn't have your makeup on, so you couldn't do it earlier. No problem here. Anything else in the courtyard? Doesn't look like it, no. Do you need something? you damn right I do. Save my game, please. Paper power. Paper Mario wishes you could do that. Alright then, let's get a move on and see what we can do. Puppy's coming down with us, no problem. Is this this other door that was locked from the outside? Yeah, it is. I thought so. Let's get the big ball guy. Oh no! Bro team! They're doing their brother's attack. I love the excessive detail in the dude's face. Look at him. Okay, there we go. You know, chat, I have to say, I've been using the uh, PNG tuber in so many streams lately. When I actually do streams and I don't have it, I feel almost naked without it. It feels strange. There we go. That's okay, though. I don't need to use it for every stream, but I like it a lot. Make the nut cookie. Oh, I hit the skelly. Hang on, I want to take these guys out for extra XP, since I was clearly getting my butt handed to me by the Cleocatra. It's been normalized, because I like it. Exactly. There we go. Nice damage. 31... Engulfed in flames? Dang. Come on. Nice. It's gonna feel weird when I get the, uh, the live 2D model. And, um, I, then I don't use the PNG tuber as much. Why not just use them all? That's what we should do. Hang on, I should make sure I heal myself with this. Life up. Just one on each of us should be okay. I do believe I'm on fire, my good sir. Check out those skeletons everywhere. Okay. Yeah, let's take him out. Bum bum. There we go, 16. Easy. 447. Oh, right, the barrels. The barrels are weak as hell enemies, but this is okay. Oh, he's got a butt. They both got butts. Get him. 
Get him before YouTube says gets mad. Combination attack. I should probably heal myself here. Use a proper life up on myself now. I want that XP though, so I'll take it. Goods, um, no, not goods. PSI is fine here. My dog is on fire, that's not good. You've heard it here first. Oh, the ghost wants to fight? I tried to talk to him. Stinky ghost and its cohorts attacked. I guess they're a higher level at this point. They can't even hurt us. That almost creepy face in the background, they look like eyeballs. 75 XP, bleh. Got a fresh mint. Ghost was cringing. Damn right it was. This place is haunted again. Um, maybe I should use the hot spring downstairs just in case. Let's do that. Perfect. Let's go, go, go. Not a long stream today. Um, after I stream, I'm going downtown for dinner again. I've been trying to make that, like, more of a regular thing for myself, and it's been working out pretty nicely, chat. Good excuse to get out of the house and go to go eat things I don't usually eat. Let me see. Next frog you meet. More ramen? No, that was last week. We're going to a Thai place this time. Oh. Puppy smelling stuff. Woof, woof. Woof, woof, woof. Oh, hang on a second. Is this, uh... Okay, I think this theme is safe. I just gotta be careful of, of, of uh, the love theme now. Have you seen Flint? He was just visiting Hinawa's grave. He's probably headed back to the mountains to look again for Klaus. Oh. I see. That's, uh... Mm-hmm. Look for Klaus, visit Hinawa's grave. Look for Klaus, visit Hinawa's grave. That's all your old man does anymore. Yeah. Seems like he has some, uh, trouble letting go about that, huh? His only salvation is, is you, Lucas. You've grown so strong that Flint doesn't need to worry anymore. You've grown up to be a truly good lad. Maybe so, but still. Here. Flint gave me this. He asked me to give it to you the next time you came by. Supposedly, it's a good luck charm your pops treasured since he was a boy himself. A courage badge. Okay. Okay. Yeah, it's unfortunately the love theme that gets claimed, so... In the future, I might have to just lower the volume so it's easier for me to uh, edit around that. Oh, the dog must have picked it up, so I'll have to give it to Lucas. Hang on. Let's give you the stuff here. Really, I could just ditch this. Or maybe I could still use it for, um... That one boss, if it becomes relevant. I don't know. Hot spring egg. I'll give this to Boney anyway. Courage badge. Oh, do I not have it? Is it a key item? Oh, it is! The rust and dirt conceals the design underneath. Let me guess, it's a Franklin badge underneath it. It's incredibly old. Oh, I, was, I thought it'd be equipment. It's okay, we'll make do with it. Twitch can still hear it, it's just... If I don't do something about it for the YouTube upload, the SoundCloud rappers will put like 50 billion ads on the video, and it'll be unwatchable. Hello? Commander Lucas here. Commander, where are you? Dakota? No, no, no. I'm just spouting nonsense. Everyone's waiting at the Chimera Lab. I still haven't arrived yet. The reason being, I forgot how to get there. I mean, I understand the directions, but... To get to the Chimera Lab, you take the crossroad train to the factory and head west from the ropeway station. Problem is, I don't know where I am right now. Hello? Are you alright, Commander? I... Oh, 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 I see a Chimera Lab now. You were right. You take crossroad train to the factory and then head west to the ropeway station. This is 100% in here because some tester got super lost. 
I guess they want me to go to the Chimera Lab. Oh, this is open now. Super bomb. Luxury banana? Nice. What's this? Oh, it's this area. What's this? There's a jar here that's too hard to ignore. Inside is a letter. Read it. Okay. Attacked. Oh, it's from the Mr. Saturns? Very bad. Come to Thunder area. Thanks, thanks. Okay, where am I at right now? Don't know if I'm even allowed to go up here, wherever that led to before. There's no enemies around here now. Can I go up this way? Transceiver seems to be reacting to the door. Try pressing the button on the transceiver. Okay. There's a jar here that's too hard to ignore. This way. Oh. This was supposed to be the first one. And, um, the second one was down over here, wasn't it? I guess I continue this way to see more of those. Mm-hmm. I think I can go back and do the Mama Mouse stuff, but, um... I don't remember how to get back there, to be honest. For now, let me just see what this if this goes anywhere. Anything here? We got spooky alien music. Well, I sure as hell hope there's, um... I sure as hell hope there's a bean thing to drive back at the end of this, because I'm already committed to the direction. I don't know if chapters are the best way to measure length for this game, because, um... Anything up here? Because chapter 6 was literally 5 minutes long. It was a cutscene, and that was it. Doesn't appear to be turned on. Okay, I can't do anything here. They weren't telling me to go this way after all? Up here is what? Oh! Oh, it takes us back here. We can do the Mama Mouse stuff. Gemini bracelet. Dude, these enemies expect me to have a group of four people. I cannot fight them. That's a really- it would be a really bad idea. Gemini bracelet. Hold up. Um... It would give, give offense plus ten. I could give that to Lucas to make his attack power a little bit better for now. At the cost of three defense, really. I'll try equipping. Wait, what? Oh, he can't wear it? I did just give it to him, though, didn't I? Wait, I didn't? I didn't. Oh, Lucas is full. D damn it, I didn't miss that. I just mashed through it. Of course I did. Now you're full, too. Damn it. Okay, fine, then. We can work with this. We can work with this. Yeah, I want the extra attack power. I shouldn't... I guess I could probably take one. I hope. Come on. But if I'm going to do the mouse thing, I should come back when I have a larger group of people, I feel. There we go. Because if these guys manage to group up when I bump into one, we're in big trouble. I could pick them off slowly, but that would be too obnoxious to get the mouse. Now, chat, I don't like to use speed up in uh, these playthroughs because I try to play it as close to OG as possible. But I think... I think it's okay, a little bit okay here. All right. I always have the button mapped. Waiting to use it. These things won't give crap now, right? 
I should be more than strong enough to fight this stuff in the forest that kicked my ass before. You know, I should sort the inventory a tad bit. Um, I feel like I'm not going to need this anymore. <clears throat> I'm going to just drop it. Let's just do that. Nut cookie. I'll just give you that. Give this one to Lucas. Oh, the sub goals? Yeah, we're just, we're actually quite near to the 500. It's pretty much a guarantee we're going to hit them. For those that missed it, um, the other day, Twisted Squid showed up and gifted 200 subs at once. So, I've got like four more playthroughs I now suddenly need to start. <laughs> Excited. So yeah, next week I was thinking I could focus on this game. So I can, um... I mean, I want time to play it first and foremost, but also being able to finish a couple games so we can start the promise stuff like Free Chef of Destruction and um, Pokemon Slide version where the entire overworld is an ice puzzle and the polished Crystal Nuzlocke I'm sure people are looking forward to. 220 total, that's right, they gifted more the next day. So nice that everybody enjoys the streams enough to do that. Okay, let's do this. I'm just picking up stray XP as I do this. But, hang on. I need 2,000, 1,500. We'll go ahead and stop in this right quick. It pays to get a little bit of XP if we need it. Where they get all this spare money? Streamers do not question these things. We simply accept them. There we go. Who cares, chat? I can spend it on a VTuber model. That is the purpose of the goals, by the way. I'm not memeing about, like, mis misspending. That's gonna take a, lo a long time, though. That stuff takes forever to get made up and rigged. L setting aside the time of, like, you know, finding a qu an artist that's available and can work for you that long. Still, I'd like to do it. Propeller Mouse does not look very safe. Your neck is rotating blades. You can never hug anyone. Let's go, go, go. Take out that puppy. Oh, we got it at the back, apparently. Keep thinking I can one-shot it. Come on. Mm-hmm. Spend it on more Teddy Button Alts. I could. In the future, even more emotes. All right, let's do it. Damn it. Okay, he's dead. Absent-minded. Let me get a drink here. My throat's feeling a bit better, but... Just gotta warm up with a bit of talking. Oh, friend, welcome. 91 XP, edible mushroom. Blah. Here, I'll take him out. Get that extra XP for the lads. Cross this bridge here. The funky moles can be a lot of fun, but I'd prefer more people for this. That's right. Let's get these guys. The Squawking Boomstick. Is this a stronger version? I feel like this looked different before. Oh. Okay. Yeah, it is a stronger variant. They were like white before, I think. Level 30 is good. Thank you, Ryram, for the four months. Appreciate it. Been waiting to see it live, I know. It's a cozy time. Was that mole there before? Hey, you kids. I'm not in a very good mood right now. I'm back some other time unless you want to get knocked flat on your butts. Hey, you kids. Okay. Can I have my... What, what is that horse thing? That wasn't here last time. Should I fight it? I want to fight it. 
Poor Sanchula? That's so cursed! Oh, That's like some Silent Hill stuff, just without the, the all the rusty-looking fences everywhere. Okay, then. Powerful kick. Come on. Damn, I'm not doing damage enough to it. Let's try smelling it. No, it's weakness. Smells like biological chimera, weak against fire. Weak against crying. All right, then, let's do it. Damn. I don't have PK fire. I don't have Kumatora. Mm-hmm. Let me just heal Boney. Damn, I'm not good with the rhythm on this one. Would also be weak against crying if I was that thing. Chat, if you could see your own weaknesses, what would they be? Personally, I feel like I'd be weak to everything. Like, I don't need, like, uh, an examination or a magic spell to tell me that I don't like being set on fire, struck by lightning, frozen by frost, poisoned, uh, being told to cry. I'm, pr I'm pretty sure I'd be weak against all of it. Weak to water? Well, I'm weak to drowning. That would probably kill me, too. 352. Let's go up over for here. Chat, I'm a streamer. If you post one mean message, I'll spend the day crying. I break easily. Damn it. Alright, we got a smash, finally. Let's have our revenge against this thing. Come on, we can take it out. Hmm? You win! Mm-hmm. Mm. Pardon me. Weak to grass because allergies? Yeah, that would suck too. Yeah, give me another egg. There. We'll get a hot spring egg by doing this. I'm weak to all forms of physical attacks, too. Those enemies that are weak to physical are rare in Shimigami Tensei, but, um... Not in real life. You push me, you stab me, you shoot me, I cry. If I don't die. Perfect. Um, let me try using Flash on it. I don't know, I feel like I can, ex I can experiment since we're near the hot spring. But Boney can't do anything. Oh boy, it's getting stronger. Come on. Didn't work. Alright, let's try using PK Teddy on it then. How much will that do? Damn it. That's good. Just take him out and go back to the hot spring. Oh! Okay, I killed it. Good. Oh, boy. Boney's here for moral support. It's still not a good idea to fight these guys. Let's go to the lab. The lab is right on that screen, too. Heal me! We did it. We feel alive again. No, you don't. Leave me alone. Oh, you're that part-timer from the other day. Perfect timing. Keep watch for me, will ya? I'm gonna go inside and help look for the escaped monkeys. Is it Salsa trying to break out his girlfriend? What is that thing on the- on the top? I just noticed that. That's disgusting. Ugh. I know it's the Chimera Lab, but... Movie? Chat, I want to watch movies. Oh, you're the part-timer who start here today, right? Yeah. Okay, cool. 
You can get inside through the back of the mini theater. The mini theater is to the right of the entrance, in case you don't know. Go through there and change your clothes. It's good to have you on board. Click. We're... Oh, a secretary bought. Welcome. The Chimera Theater is currently closed. We're... Click. I have some special medicine here, not sold in any vending machines. Could I interest you in some? Sure. That's not medicine. I don't want that. If you ever need anything else, I'm your man. This area is off limits, and don't you dare try to find some way inside. What does the vending machine here have? Very good stick. My inventory's full, though. Let me just sell something, then. Um, this... What do I hold... What am I wearing right now? I don't need to carry the regular stick, then. Friends yo-yo. I could just sell the stick, then. The, the yo-yo is probably the best. Better stick. Bug spray. I'll keep pretending I'm gonna use it later. Taurus bracelet. I might still use that. This thing I should hang on to, I still feel like. That's a super bomb, luxury banana, edible mushroom. I don't need this no more. It's too weak. I don't know why I even picked this up. I don't do anything with it. I can get more of them. Azure ribbon. You're the only one that can wear it. I'll just ditch it. It's kind of old one. Yogurt. Peculiar cheese. The secret herb. Oh, right. The secret herb is how you revive. Very good stick is offense plus 34. Um What did the what did the yo-yo have? I actually can't remember. I know I just looked at it. Plus 30. Oh, uh, I guess I'd rather have the plus 30 in the speed right now. I feel like I gotta wait for something better. It's not worth the money. Alright. And the rest of it is regular ass items, huh? I guess we don't really need much else, but we made a save. I should deposit my money here then. How much do I have? Withdraw balance is that. 500 on hand. Deposit then. We'll make a quick save then. Please be careful out there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Check out the bathroom. There's a ghost. More ghosts. Why is it getting more spooky every time I try to pee? Just one. Okay. Even in the bathroom, I can save. I really suggest you save your game here. Uh... But there was one right outside. I mean, he really suggested it, so it must be important. What if I run into it? I can ram into it. But nothing happens. Weird. Is it like a joke about haunted girls' bathrooms because the game is Japanese? I'm assuming so because, you know, that's that's like one of those things, right? You go into like the women's bathrooms in Japan and like some scary lady will like drown you in the toilet. That might be the case. Anything over here? This is a, this is a mini theater, all right. It looks cozy. Okay, we can go backstage, but what's down there? Oh, I thought that was a door for some reason. Silly me. Nothing else actually here. What kind of movies could we watch here, chat? We could watch a whole series of moomins. There are pig masks in here. Put them on. Oink, oink, chat. Look at me. I got a mask on like this, but barely fits the puppy. Pardon me, I'm a little stuffy. Fix myself up. Has it really been an hour already? Not bad. Not problem here. Bunch of yucky laundry is inside. Yucky. 
No problem. Nothing over here. No problem here. No problem here. I see a map. Chimera Lab... Oh, Chimera Lab map. Okay, this area looks quite big. Okay, what floor did I come from? Wait a second. I came from over there. That's where was a, there was a ladder. I see. So before... Wait, wait. Wait, did I come from the third floor? I did, didn't I? I thought that went down. No, that went down. So I'm... Oh, okay, I misread the map. I understand now. I understand. I was just looking at it wrong. Don't mind me. Hey, what's up? Perfect timing. You guys are part-timers, right? Then get looking, too. Some monkeys have gone missing. They should be hiding somewhere in the lab. There's two of them. Scour every last inch of the place. Okay. Perfect timing. You guys are part-timers. Then get looking, too. Some monkey's gone missing. I was about to go home for the day, but now I have to look for some stupid monkeys. They are so gonna get reconstructed if I get my hands on them. Slot there for money here. Insert 10 DP. I have no money. No problem here. Where am I at? Okay, there's only up and over here then. Let's keep having a look around. Eyes right and posture check. What was that? Whoa! I can go across it like that. No problem here. Ugh. Don't worry, I had a quick drink. We hydrated, we being healthy. And these stairs go down to that way. Should I check out the rest of this floor first? Nah. Yo. Parental Kanga Shark. 10 billion? That is 10 billion, right? I don't care enough to count the zeros. Ostra Elephant, 8 billion. Ein Swine. That's too much for an Ein Swine. Porky08. Sold out. That's a bit ominous right there. Memo about the kind of chimeras I want. Ones that don't eat much. Ones as nice and loving as they are cool. Ones with a decent flavor and scent. Ones that won't cry at night. Ones that make good bodyguard. Ones with great coat of fur. Ones that don't chew with their mouth open. Ones that poop that stink don't... Ones with poop that doesn't stink much. Ones that are warm-hearted. Ones that aren't oversensitive. She's gotta be fit, clean, thin, do all my laundry, or else she doesn't have a chance with a guy like me. <laughs> what about over here? What's in the pockets of this? Lab coats have been neatly cleaned. No problem here. No problem here. Re uh, instructions are written on the whiteboard. Emergency measures. Should the ultimate chimera escape from its cage, see all entrances and exits immediately. In the unlikely event it gets outside, use full force to feign ignorance and pretend nothing happened. In the event that the ultimate chimera is seen by civilians, the rest has been erased and is, and is unreadable. Ah, the Umbrella Corporation approach. I love that policy. No problem here. In the event of major disaster, plug ear, pl plug fingers and ears and go la 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 la, can't hear you. What do we got here? Saltwater gun. An image of an odd creature you've never seen before is displayed on the screen. Guess we're not going to be able to see it. But, lots of graph here, but there's no telling what they mean. That's the elevator. Good to know where those are. Oh, this is the entrance. Hey, you guys. Where do you think you're going? You're on the job. Okay. That's another elevator. Hang on. 
Elevators must connect to, to the, yeah, the corresponding one, so... It looks like the only elevator that goes to the bottom floor is on the first floor. Okay, these ones only go up like that. Let's just make sure we check everything regardless. Don't mess with the elevators until we need to yet. This is the other staircase. Is this blocked off over here? Let's see. The next room over is the specimen room, and then and then those stairs take you to the first floor, and then there's an elevator in that room over there with the door open, I think. Huh? Now I'm all confused again, but I think that's right. Should I repeat that? No. What a relief. Whoa. Bones! A skull of a young Drago. Some bones, who knows? Some bones, who knows? Full Dragosaurus skeleton. Full cactus wolf. Ostra elephant. Cattle snake. Some sort of competition trophy has been placed here as decoration. Runner up. Regular route, but you know, do whatever you want. Save your game? Don't mind if I do. This frog being like everywhere in, in funny little places. It reminds me of the cat in Witch's house. Even when stuffed, a frog is still a frog. Oh, you're stuffed, are ya? Well, it's multiple frogs in this one, but you know what I mean. Oh. There are many unidentifiable objects here, all preserved in formaldehyde. Whole bodies of animals, large and small, are being preserved in chemicals. You get the feeling that staying in here for too long will make you lose your appetite. Okay, they all say the same thing and advance their own way. What if I bump into them? Oh, there's a present! Doggy biscuit. Alright, that's underwhelming. We'll just leave a little bit, then. Agitated boar. Horsantula. Balding eagle. Dogfish. Cattle snake. Uh, batang. I know it's bat and orangutan, but how do I say that? B Batangutan? Mutroom. And the parental Kanga shark. Brain specimens of various animals are stored here without a lid on them? You're gonna get so much dust and like exposure to the elements on those brains. Even I know that's a bad idea. Hey! It's Salsa and his girlfriend. Dude, you can see the whole you can see the whole muscle like nervous system attached to that brain. The nervous systems of various animals are preserved in chemicals here. It's like that one part of Metal Gear Rising. Hopefully there are no bear brains here. Oh, why would you say that? Why would you say that? Now I'm worried about the teddies. I'm worried about potential teddy bears being locked up in here, being experimented on. This is awful. No teddies. Nothing else here. No problem here, but there are clearly many problems here. Look out! What? An almost mecha lion suddenly attacked. Oh, is it that time of day? Alright then. Wait, shoot? Is that because I have a yo-yo? Let me see. Hmm. Let's do this. And smell you. Weak against lightning? If only I had a character that could do that. Weak against crying, aren't we all? Be healed. Okay, if that's the case now. Hmm. Let's go ahead and heal you up or something. This. 
Almost Mecha Lion use a biting attack. Envelop by a counter. Yay. I'm gonna do this again. Damn it. Only that much damage, huh? Only six that time, but it's okay. I'm gonna go for it to make sure our defense is topped up as much as possible. Come on, a little bit of damage there. Damn it, Lucas gotta get healed. Lucas, please heal yourself without dying or I'm gonna be screwed. Come on. No, come on, Lucas. Okay, there we go. Just in time. Now let's try a PK Teddy on him. Damn it, I can't get the rhythm on this. Lucas is gonna have to make sure he tops himself up again. Nice. Poisonous tail? Oh, give me a break. Like I need this now too. Ugh. This is a problem. No problem. Heal you. Goods. I have an antidote, but you need to be attacking right now. Use the Tart on Lucas. It's gonna be the only way we're gonna get out of this, I feel. Okay, 30. Oh, he got a crit. Of course he did. I'd be dead right now if I didn't defense up. Okay, here's what I'm gonna do. We're gonna use a life up on Boney, and Boney is gonna go ahead and give me a hot spring egg. We're gonna top ourselves up. At least that counter is doing a little bit to him. Okay, I think we're on a turn. We can actually attack him now. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Okay, that was good. Lucas attacks. You know what? Why not? Give him the cheese. Lucas loves cheese. Okay. Damn it. Hang on. I'm gonna go ahead and life up Lucas. Bony attacks this time. Damn it. Counter's done. Damn it. Surely this accounts for me only having two people here. Damn it. Okay, Lucas is gonna attack you, and Boney's just gonna use that antidote up. We need this free up space anyway. It's not enough that it's almost mechanical lion. It has to be poisonous almost mechanical lion, too. Okay, nice. I can't believe that 16 actually was the killing blow. Are you serious? Because it would have automatically stopped if it, um, if I hit his end, um, hit his last health point in the middle of it. Holy crap. Can I reveal a secret about this fight? Yeah, sure, it's done now. My heart biggest trouble was getting the first beat. <laughs> Once I get it going, I it's just perfect there. Wait, it doesn't matter if you win or lose, the game progresses normally after this fight. Oh. So I didn't have to win? Well, I did. How hard is it to, um... How hard is it to actually win this? Did I just, um... So I'm just an accidental god gamer? Oh, I, I guess. Chat, if I'm just that good, I'm just that good. 
I guess I can't help it. Bony's level is 31. Did it on my first try, too. Got extra XP. That was worth it. Well then, are you okay, cute part-timer? What'd you call me? This compliment will carry me through the whole week. How many are left? Just the one now. The one? You mean the red one with the huge mouth? Yeah. That means serious trouble. And just standing here won't solve anything. For now, let's hurry and seal the exits. Oh, the ultimate one. Watch yourselves, guys. Oink, oink. Hey, cute part-timer. There's actually one more that's still lurking around here somewhere. One that's way more dangerous than that one just now. If while looking for the monkeys, you happen to see a red thing with a gigantic mouth, get the heck out of there. All right, is the Mr. X theme gonna play in a moment? Listen, pay to close attention now. If you run into a red, huge mouth chimera, do absolutely nothing to it. Got that? I've warned you. And while I'm wa warning you like this, I should add that it'd be even more dangerous not to take the time out to talk to that frog. Bro, they are really hyping this thing up. I don't think this is an optional boss I can, uh, beat. <laughs> Alright then. It's nice to know that I beat the boss that I was, uh, expected to kind of die to. That's nice. Perfect. Even when stuffed, I'm still a frog. Okay, chat. I guess now this is a horror game. Let's see what happens. I probably should walk through the doors right now. I'm a little scared. Uh, let's see. The next room over is the specimen room. Same dialogue. And then, then the stairs. Yeah, it's the same dialogue here. <sighs> the music cut out, and I hear something stomping in the distance. You guys can hear that, right? It's very faint. I can't believe I got assigned to this post. Is that why the elevators... Oh, the elevators are for avoiding it. Oh. Oh. Made it sound like it was there. It's very, very low. I could turn it up a little bit more. <sighs> Not even playing and I'm on edge right now. Oh, yeah. Oh, it's that thing! It's that thing from Smash Brothers that does a billion damage when you touch it. Okay, now I understand why I shouldn't fight it. Okay. Yeah, right there, buddy. Dr. Andonuts? I realize you have an ass, but my name is Dr. Andonuts. I'm being forced to conduct various sorts of research by a certain man. Currently, though, I'm trying to conceal myself for certain reasons. I didn't see him earlier. Was he here? I'm a bit occupied at the moment. Could you come back at a better time? Yeah, I probably should. I kind of want to see what happens when I bump into it. Hang on. I, I, I kind of want to bump into it. Why wouldn't I? Oh. Oh, it just straight up murdered me. Not even a battle. 
I'm not gonna lose my stuff. I'm just gonna do that. <laughs> A lot of freaking damage on it. That's why we save. Okay. So is it always gonna be down here? Yeah, it is. Just showing the content. Okay. So I've checked out that big area. It looks like the the chimera is blocking the, the way to the one elevator that goes to the basement. I should check out the third floor now, maybe, if it's down there. There's an elevator. The pig squealing in the background makes it worse. Edible mushroom. Ooh, who's, keep, who's keeping that in their locker? No problem here. What's with that glass? Why is there a why is there a seat with a wine glass? The only way to reach this elevator is to go from downstairs. That dude must have something important to say. Let's find out. Wait, no, not the first floor. That's where he is. I'm not sure how the Chimera moves around. It's at the end of the room. Wait, no, the music's back. Uh, second floor. So if the Chimera is there, I need to find some way to get it to move away from there. No music on this floor, though. So if I go here... Oh, it's gone! Oh. Wait, that elevator goes to the basement? Huh? Then what room is this again? Monkeys. Yeah, some ran through this door, actually. Why didn't I run after them, you ask? Ow, ow, ow. My stomach, it pains me so. Yeah, the Ultimate Chimera or Kimura or whatever it's called. Uh, I'd make quick work of it if only it weren't for my aching stomach. Like they say, can't fight on an aching stomach, so leave the rest to you. All right. Frosty room. That's a Drago. Covered in frost. There seems to be an animal encased in ice in here. Frigid air is blowing, blowing ceaselessly from the machine. It's so cold that someone could probably freeze in here. This Drago has been frozen and encased in ice. Bony got a bomb. Can't see what's inside. Oh, well, we got stuff. Just have a little look around, chat. Where everything is wholesome and nice. Everyone is just kind of dying in there. Isn't that bad? What's this? There's just nothing out here, it seems. Well, maybe this is needed for something later. I should check out the elevator since I could seem to get in here now. How many of them are dying out there, you think? Probably a lot. What do we have here? For part-timers, you sure do work hard. You're really something. But you should probably get out of this building as fast as you can. No problem here. There's a present. Pork stew. The monkey. It let the red one out of its cage. We're done for now. I put some rice balls in the freezer room, but they wound up frozen solid. I should have eaten them sooner. Alright. I'm sure this is a good room. 
Somebody spilled some strawberry jam and there's an ominous light going on, but mm, it looks safe. What is that? What the, what the hell is that thing? What am I looking at? Is that like a, a walrus gorilla? Hey, what's up? No, don't run away. Finding them seems to activate story events, so... I don't know what the hell that thing is, though. Hang on, let me make sure... Let me check something. Okay, they're still gone, so... I just want to make sure that they're supposed to leave, and I'm not supposed to, like, take the mask off and approach them safely. I have to stay in the mask, I think. Mm -mm. Okay. I opened the door and it was standing like right there. Oh man, this is too much for me to handle. If that's the red, if the, that red one's out there, I'm just gonna have to wait out in the freezer room. Are we going to the freezer room? Huh? Something's making noise. Something was making noise. Seems to be an animal encased in there. Nothing's making noise in here anymore. That made you jump, it made me jump too. Wait, the elevator goes to the basement? Okay, nothing else here. I think what he's what this guy is trying to tell me is that if the monster is in this room, I have to go to the freezer room to get it to leave. And that's what I ended up just doing. Hey, what's up? No problem here. No problem here. Just leave it at that, would you? Let's see, uh, exits to the south, and there's an elevator in this room, and the west is the pressing room, opportunity room. Opening room, you know, the room where they do surgery. Actually, come to think of it, those monkeys fled into the basement earlier. But how do you get to the basement? Yeah, I took care of that already, so they're working for somewhere else. Hey, uh, bro, you m maybe want to let us the hell out of here? Hey, you guys, where do you think you're going? You're on the job! <laughs> Guess what? Minimum wage is not worth maximum effort to survive this goddamn place. I have a special medicine here. No, we don't need that. Maybe make another save here. I... Oh, is this why he says suggest to save your game? He expects me to check this later, I guess, during this part. This part is spooky. I'm sure, like, every person- every streamer in the world who plays this sees the Chimera and is like, Oh, the thing from Smash Brothers! Because, of course, most people are going to see it from that first. Okay. Maybe if I go this way... Walking carefully. This part's pretty neat. This game has a lot of cool parts. I like it. Suddenly it's a horror game. It's pretty sick. Oink! Oink! I really gotta stop running. I almost ran into it earlier. This is the only hallway that still has music. We didn't end up going into the hot spring room yet. We really should. Oh, we really should go a different direction is what I meant to say. This is why we stop running. 
Oh, you say the same thing. I'm not sure what makes this thing move around, in all honesty. Hey, parent, I haven't been in here yet. Squawk, I'm not stuffed. I'm alive. I'm plenty alive, Dagnabbit. The same thing. All kinds of mathematical formulas have been scribbled here. Secret herb. All kinds of formulas. Various things are lined up in confusion here. Okay, nothing really here. What about that paper on the desk? No. What it's used for is anyone's guess. The elevator then? Maybe the monkeys went here. Now he's on the other side. Hmm. Yeah, I, I'm, don't actually tell me how it moves around. I don't want. I don't want the the. St it's spoiled for me. It's best I don't know. We all know that. I'm just kind of thinking aloud. That locker's open. This locker is empty. Open it! <laughs> mhm. Mm Bro, that they know what they're doing. That they know what they're doing and it's pissing me off. I can't talk to this guy. He's always going to be on the other side of the wall every time. I wonder if he has, like, some kind of dialogue where you talk to him. He's like, you can't see me without cheating. I guess now we're looking for the next place the monkeys must have gone to. That is a good use of, um, usually I don't like when games do the thing where it's like you have to hunt for the next, like, event trigger or something. But I feel like in the context of this, where there's a monster wandering around... It kind of it kind of does work. I haven't been in this room yet. There's a large machine here. What it's used for is anyone's guess. Welcome everybody. Welcome to the fun place. No problem here. It's like okay, he's not he's not gone. Um, we've checked all along in here. Unless anything's changed. No, I don't see any of the monkeys again. Just wanted to double check. I checked the outside room as well. Make a save at the save frog. So many oinks. Don't worry, that's just the screams of pain of people dying. I still didn't go into the uh, hot spring room, did I? Because there's that, that he's blocking it, I can't get in there. Um, we checked out the basement. Uh, what about floor one again? No, we checked everything there. Now, I feel like I gotta check something on floor one. I gotta find the monkeys. You're different. Stop! Stay away! This is my hiding spot! Okay. Nothing in here. Oh, alright, I found them. Thank you, Kiba, for the 13 months there. Appreciate it. I just remember the Chimera's weakness, so I mustered up the courage to come here. Hey, it's me! 
This is a high-tech battery-operated Chimera. In other words, if we set the power switch on its back to off, it will stop. You can do that, though, can't you, Salsa? He remembers that boy. Salsa's gotta return the favor now. Lucas got his dinosaur friends, because that's just what he knows to do. Well? He's going! Let's get the hell out of here. There's a large button on its back. You need to press it. Come now, be courageous. Use the dog as bait. Okay, maybe I'm gonna use you as bait. Terrible father and not an animal lover either, apparently. He did it. Oh! Thank you, lad and monkey. I think I'll use this opportunity to leave the military and devote my life to making all living things happy. This is the same doctor from Earthbound, right? I'm not, like, misremembering his name, I don't think. Or is it, like, a similar name and I can't remember? Yes, yes, indeed. Okay, Jeff's father. Devote my life to making all living things happy. That's right, that is a new emote. Cheerleader Teddy Ursa. Oh, uh... You, uh, agree with my idea? Thank you, dog. I-I'm sorry! I was merely joking about the bait thing! It's a simple misunderstanding, you have it all wrong! Hey, what's up, Mr. Monkey? Salsa joined your party. Is Boney gone? What happened? Can this game just let me have party members? There we go. Uh-oh. Is it gonna... Oh, the little bird was piloting it. I understand. Looks like we're not done dealing with it. Okay, she wants us to go over here. Let's have a look here. You're level 13? Man, we haven't seen you since chapter 2. Um, hang on a second. Do I have any extra stuff you can... Yeah, you can take my bracelets. DC MC pamphlet. That's all I really got, huh? All right, that'll do, it'll have to do. I can put the flea charm on. Go down. I re read that wrong, sorry. Yeah. Weapon, no idea what you even use, but we got ya. Used to checking the map for everything. It's not nice to ditch your friends. You, where is the, where are they? There you are. There's a door here. Dancing figures are depicted on it. We gotta do a monkey dance? Nah, we'll never see the Chimera again. Why would we? Oh, I'm playing as you. Yeah, monkey dance! Dance, monkey! Open the magic door that we can't just climb over. Yeah! He knows what he's doing. Importing all those dance moves. Sick. Alright. And what do we got here? Can't open the map. Yeah, let's make a little save, why don't we? Yeah, 
Okay. Magic gloves? I assume they're for him. Nope, that must be for, uh... Oh, no, 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 don't do that. Yeah, yeah, they're for Kumatora, it seems. Okay. Ooh, they're mittens. They look extra comfy. Ooh. Seashell house. Wait, a magican house. That's right. What about down here? Can't go in there. Getting mittens. Yo, what's up? There's Komatora. I didn't even realize it was her for a second. Whoa, awesome! You really did show up, Lucas. How's it going? Oh, and you're here too, Salsa? Great to see you again. I didn't know you were alive. Oh, and how you been, love monkey? Hello. She's scared. Oh my, what adorable visitors. Introduce me to them, won't you? Yeah, yeah, sure. These are my friends. This is Salsa, the monkey, and his love monkey. This is Lucas, the human. And this dog is... It, 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 what was the dog's name again? It's Boney. Boney the dog! I, I love that guy! No. <laughs> so you're sweet little Lucas? Iona's told me all about you. Come with me. I'll show you where the needle is. I need to get that, apparently? Oh yeah, I almost forgot. Lucas, that's Doria, one of the seven frog people. He saved me. Apparently that's what fate had in store. From the fall. Alright then, come along, Salsa. A map of Nowhere Island. Yeah. It sure is a map. First, know this. Oh, okay, this is just... Oh no, is it gonna... It's gonna play the whole thing again? I can't skip this. So I'm just gonna do this. I'm sorry, we don't need to see that again. We're not... We don't need to see that whole thing again. <laughs> I didn't think it would, like... I thought I could skip that. After I fell from the airship, Doria was there to rescue me. Apparently, a pretty woman dressed in red appeared in Doria's dreams and foretold I'd fall in this pond. For some reason, after I heard that story, I just knew you guys were all right, too, and that I'd see you again. I was a little worried about you, though, Lucas. Doria also says Duster's all right. I think he is, too. Iona told me you'd come here. The needle I'm guarding is at the bottom of this pond. My needle is much more of a pain to pull out. Giggle. And... It's hard to believe you really have the power to pull needles, but before you can even try, we need to move the water from this pond into the empty hole first. You know the Chimera Laboratory to the west of here? There might be some junk there that could help us move the pond water. Why not look for something there? There's a monster roaming around that. Uh, you want to come with us? After I fell from the airship? No. What about you? Nothing. Alright, Celsus coming along then. Fine, swine. It's just a brain gra- It's literally grappled into the pig's eye holes? Whoa. We need to get Salsa some XP. Brain shock. I need to get to the- I need to get to the frickin' hot spring. There we go. 422. Salsa's level 14. Salsa will slowly catch up after a handful of battles, I think. Already about to evolve again. Or level up. 
Okay, let's leave that thing alone. First and foremost, I'm going to... You. There's a window broken. The red one. It chomped right through the fence and escaped. Cool. Uh, maybe I'll take one. Pig masks, masks here are kind of like ruining everybody's vibe, not gonna lie. Ooh. Relaxing in the hot spring, and let's do it. Salsa's name is actually a pun on the Japanese word for monkey, which is Saru. Okay. One of those things that doesn't translate the best in English, but you still appreciate. I think we're supposed to go up here, but let me talk to uh, the professor. Oh, lad. Thank you for earlier. What's that? You're looking for a way to transfer all the water from one pond to another? Hmm. Those eyes of yours, lad. They're the eyes of someone who's taken on some sort of mission. Very well. I'll lend you a helping hand. Achoo. What is that thing? Behold! Is that a hair dryer? And, uh, I've brought several of the chimeras I've been developing in secret. Take whichever one you think will be the most useful. That's Dry Guy. It's the latest model dryer chimera, and it utilizes an air, air intake system and a jet engine. It can dry anything in mere moments, even long hair, afros, uh, uh, panties, and Asian beauties. All right, then. Are you certain this is what you want? No. Who are you? These are the Bucket Brothers. They're the result of combining cutting-edge dough technology with Clayman- Wait, what? They're Chimeras too? Clayman technology. These fellows are exceptionally hard workers. Are you certain what they want? No. Ah, that one. Huh. That's a rather ho-hum Chimera known as a pipe- uh, Sorry, pump Chimera. It's an extraordinary, ordinary creature- that's really only useful when you need to transfer something from one place to another, such as pond water. You certainly want something as uninteresting as this? <laughs> okay. This is the one I clearly need, though, right? I wonder if they all work, though. Too late. Oh, yes, here we are. This will solve our pond water dilemma. I just know it. Bucket Brothers would just take buckets and get it all done. They all do it? Okay. Wow, look at them suck up the water. Ooh, the pond's slowly emptying. More, do more. Ooh, look there. Just look at them go. It's enough to give me chills. No, the only this is the only one that works. The other ones just fail. Okay. Kind of wish I did them all then, but it's too late. Well, we did it. Oh, just look at him swagger away so confidently. He leaves the stage with such calm air about him. What a Casanova. Bravo, Mr. Pump. There it is. That's the needle. One of the seven needles sealing the dragon away. Now pull it. Pull it right out. Come on now. Do it. Squeak, squeak. What's... What's gonna happen to us? What indeed... Well, let's pull it out. 
Can you really pull this needle like Iona said? I'm not sure if I should be afraid or happy. A rush of emotions is overcoming me. I can't believe I'm here witnessing this moment. And another thump. Okay, now pull it. With all your might. Right before my very eyes. If this needle gets pulled, will you disappear like Eola did? Yes, that's right. Because the needle won't need my protection anymore. The needle can only be pulled when the time comes. So when the needle finally is pulled, the time has come. We frog people have lived our lives so we can happily accept that fate when it comes. Don't worry, I'm not gonna die. I'm simply gonna follow fate and disappear. So it will be a happy thing. I do have many fond memories though, so it will be a little sad too. Hold the needle? Well, if we don't, someone else is gonna. Yeah! We got the power. Uh-oh. What did I do? Red steam is coming out of there. Now it's purplish. Magenta. Something awoke inside Lucas. PK Teddy Beta. This really is the beginning of the end. The time has finally come. I never once imagined someone would show up at this tender girl's home to pull the needle. Disappearing while still young and beautiful. In one sense, it's bliss. Gumatora, go with little Lucas here and see things through to the end. I'm about to disappear youthfully and beautifully. Think about me sometimes, okay? Here, take this memento of me. Oh my, your inventory's full. Oh well, too bad. What, what do you mean, too bad? I leave the rest in your hands now. Bye now. La la la. Put it in someone else's inventory, then. It'll be somewhere else, don't worry. Okay, that's good. It'll just be in the house. Okay. Iona told me this a long time ago. When the dark dragon that's sleeping under the island wakes up, all life and all time will be reborn. And... I don't know what's gonna happen, but I'm gonna see things through to the end. Lucas, can I come along with you? I wanna go with you. We have to hurry and find Duster in the Egg of Light, too. I'm still not sure on the importance of the Egg of Light. I just know we need it, apparently. Umatora joined your party. Salsa, we just met again after all this time. But it looks like this is goodbye again. Is this it for you? What's with that look? You're such a sentimental monkey. Let's go. Let's get the next needle. You and Love Monkey take care now. Huh? What is it? A nut? For me? Received a nut. Thanks. See you later, if we ever get the chance. Happy! And now they're going. 
Does that mean I can't go in here? Okay, good. Let's go get that memento. I'm gonna watch them all slowly walk in. For some reason. Hold that thought, though. Let me check my stuff. I ended up giving Salsa an item, and now he's gone with it. <laughs> okay. We've got plenty of uh, space here. Hang on. First, the magic gloves. We're going to give those to Kumatora. You know what? Let her hold this, too, in case we somehow need it later. I should give the bombs to um, Boney. Just at least... Yeah. Yeah, why not? Give it to Boney. Boney's mostly full on stuff now. Only 80 HP on that. And let's see. Yeah, it's a pretty significant increase. We'll take those. Magic pendants. Don't really need that. Azure ribbon. Taurus bracelet. Same one we got already. Okay, let's go in here and see what the memento is. Oh, received a nut. Salsa and friends are just going to chill there. The magic butterfly made everyone in Luke's, Lucas's party relax. Receive Doria's memento. Okay, that covers that. We got our main girl back. Now let's make a save. Please be careful out there. Give my regards to the next frog you meet. Okay. Seem to be doing okay. Wait, what? Squeak! Squeak! The squeaks? What's your problem? Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold it right there. Just where do you think you're going? The squeaks? Get that hair. He's like the fawns, but he squeaks instead. I say we get beat the hell out of him. Let's get him. Let's make him pay. Now that I got PK freeze, what's he gonna do about it? Cry? The squeaks use a biting attack. Let's go. The squeaks was taught a lesson. 157? That was nothing. Squeak, squeak, squeak! I humbly apologize for my rude, egotistical attitude despite being so weak. Back on the highway, I was known as the hippest cat around, but now I'm just a pathetic excuse for a mouse. All the girls dug me, but I'm definitely no fighter. But you help me remember who I really, really am. I wonder if my wife and seven kids I left on the highway are doing okay. Oh, the mother mouse. Whoa, I'm suddenly feeling homesick now. I'm going back. But yeah, I'm going back. Anyway, do it. I'm heading back home. Watch out for them mole crickets if you keep going east. Again, so sorry. A whole ass character arc occurred there. Okay. Are there still enemies here? There's this thing, and we got thing here. We should be able to, like, beat this thing easily. Check everyone's level requirements. It's been a bit since we got it. Okay. 3,000 for you. We're most of the way through with these. Let me get one of these right here. You want more? Yes. Lucas got a fresh egg. Now let's just go ahead and hop in the hot springs for just a teeny bit longer. Been two hours of Mother 3. Not bad so far, Chad, is it? We've been healed. We've been blessed. Let's get in here again. Now you're gonna be... Alright. Ah, oh, damn it. Let's see. They said... The dude implied going east was where we needed to go, but what's up over there? I don't know if I went up that direction yet. I think it was weak to fire, yes.
104. Come on. There we go. Oh boy. Hang on. Up over here is the base of a mountain. Maybe there's an item I didn't pick up yet. There's Einswines here. Magic tart. Yeah, we can grab those. We can take out these chumps. Come on. Einswine turned around. Four twenty-two magic tart. Well, damn, that's nice. Can abuse those later. Still need to throw some things away. What? Oh, come on. Did not sneak up. I don't feel like leaving stuff at the item guy, to be honest. I feel like it's kind of unneeded. Oh, that sucks. No, let's do this. Come on. Oh, this is great. Fine, then. We'll just cook this bacon. Or freeze this bacon. Didn't hit anyone. Come on. Okay, good. We killed it just in time. I need to get back to the hot spring again. Clearly. Ah, crap. Now I gotta walk- I gotta walk with inverted controls now. Leave me alone, horse- horse Angela. I don't want to deal with that. Now let's see what's to the east. Okay, good, it missed me. That thing's annoying. No one on this map. Whoa, 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 whoa! So you kept true to your promise and finally came to the mole cricket hole, huh? It's me. Don't you recognize me? I'm the mole cricket you fought at Alex's place when you were play fighting with the Dragos as a little kid. I've been training for this day all these years. Okay, let's go. Battle has come. Follow me. Oh boy. Guess we're doing this now. All the way over here, against our will. That guy's watching us, being like, what the hell are we doing? <laughs> here it is. This is where you and me are gonna fight it out. This is where my right hand will be raised into the air when I'm declared the winner. And this is where you're gonna hit the ground with a thud. This is the place, Mole Cricket Hole. I'll widen the hole a bit for you to fit through. Come on. All right then, maybe we should save. Please be careful out there. Well, this is spooky. What is that? Something that looks like a lotus root is blocking the path. We're mole crickets. We dig holes and live in them. We're exceptionally proud. Okay, hot springs down here. I need to heal at this one. Nothing down there, it seems. Okay, we're gonna have to leave those alone, it seems. Oh, glad to see you didn't wimp out on me. This here is our elder. I've asked him to be the judge for our match today. If you try to run away or do anything cheap, neither of us will sit by quietly. Just so you know. Anyways, I got special rules for our match. If by some chance an outcome hasn't reached 
isn't reached after 10 minutes, we'll go over time, which will last five more minutes. And if a conclusion still isn't reached after that, our elder who will decide who the winner is. Elder, is there anything you'd like to add? Wait, you folks are truly seriously going to fight him. Take my advice. Sometimes the bravest thing to do is to run away. But if you insist on it, in that case, I won't stop you. You ready to do this thing? Sure. All right, I guess you have no care for your own life. I'll stretch a little bit, yeah. The bell has rung. The mole cricket. All right. I'm not even sure if this is a real fight I need to do. Oh, he did one damage. Weak against ice, weak against crying. Damn! You win! Two experience points, damn. That's enough, that's enough, we give up. To think such a mighty mole cricket warrior could be so easily defeated. Perhaps mole crickets aren't so powerful after all. I'll meditate on what else this means in a later time. For now, the match is over. I suppose the traditional thing to do now is to be on good terms with you. So let's be friends. Is there anything you need? Mm-hmm. Actually, yeah. Do you know where the needles sealing away the dark dragon are? We're looking for them. We mole crickets aren't very knowledgeable creatures, but call it a hunch, I think there could be a clue to this object on the mountain in the far end of the mole cricket hole. I figure that's what the Elder wants to say, too. He's hard to read sometimes, though. Yeah, I agree. The mountain. Go through the mole cricket hole and head up the mountain. I'm certain that's what you must do. Yeah, sure, let me chug some water. I'm thirsty after that rough boss fight. The mountain, huh? We don't have any other leads to follow up on, so let's check it out. Oh, uh, hey. You guys don't know anything about the Dark Dragon itself, do you? Sadly, we don't. We really are just mole crickets. Even though he's our elder, he's still just a mole cricket too. We have no real strength at all, it's a pity. The very least we can do is help you by eating the lotus roots blocking your way and other things like that. Wow, a dragon. I bet it's really incredible. It must be incredible indeed. I've learned so much today. A dragon that sleeps underground, needles that seal it away, us being surprisingly weak? Living a long life is worth it. Do you suppose you could tell us mole crickets about more things? Sure. Thanks. We'll try not to be too much of a bother. So please raise us to be great. To start off, I'm thinking of starting a business in your own unique mole cricket way. Please stop by if you happen to see us. Oh yeah, if you're gonna go through the mole cricket hole, you should take my little bro with you. He's little, but a tough one. You can trade him just like any other item. Hey, little bro, come here. Mole cricket brother. You get lost in the mole cricket hole? Just ask my little bro for help and he'll bring you straight back here. Right, little bro? Come on, bro, get your act together. Bad news is he's kind of lame and hates the sunlight more than anything else in the world. So be careful, you can't take him with you outside the hole. Right, little bro? Okay then, finally, let's move. Eaten. Here, I'll give you this unbelievably accurate yet help unhelpful map. Okay. That doesn't actually look like... That doesn't actually look like it, though. Oh god, they're serious, aren't they? I'm guessing we need to get to that one up there. What's accurate about this? Mole cricket hole is really big, you know? You're gonna get bored fast if you don't pointless chit-chat with us. That one's green. Crawl, crawl, save your game. Sure. Thank you, I'm so happy you believe me. I'll work hard to save your game just right. 
Sure. Take care. Give my regards to the next frog you meet. Mole crickets know everything. Just about everything ever. Like how to dig holes and how to win fights. Next to doubt. Well, I... Wait, what? But... But I was just... Bro. <laughs> this map is so... Tr <laughs> this map is so worthless. Well, let's try looking. I've gone down, and now I'm over here. Uh... You want to get what's on the other end of the mole crooked hole? Everything over there is mysterious for some reason. I'm not brave at all, so I'm scared to go. If there's a turn, turn, even if you don't want to. Do that, you'll eventually reach the other end of the, uh, the mole crooked hole. Have faith in yourself and proceed not straight ahead. Time for another song. It's a twisty, turny road, but it's not the path I chose. But don't complain, just grin and bear it as you go down the twisty, turny road. It's not the path I chose. Who did it choose? Who, who did choose it, I wonder? Whenever there's a turn, be sure you turn. No matter what happens, turn at every turn. Do that, you'll never get lost. All right, turn. Chat, let's follow their advice and just turn at every turn. Just turn. Every time we see one, just turn. Game said to do that, so we're gonna do that. Turn, turn, turn. Nope, said turn, didn't say, don't, can't go straight. Turn, they said. Can't run easily in here. Turn. Turn, turn, turn. Turn, turn. See? You do it easily. Now we just turn again. Where am I? Over there, apparently. Let's just keep going. The best map ever. Yes, you're telling me. Reach another turn. There's another one. Oh, hang on. Now we gotta turn again. Wait, I've been here, though. I I've been to this one, haven't I? I'm almost positive I've been I've been to that one, but... No, let's keep following the knowledge. Turn. Turn again. I'm losing faith. Every time you see a turn, just turn. Thank you, Scroll, for gifting five subs there. Appreciate it. Okay, turn. At the first turn. Every time. Have I been here? I'm questioning it. There's not enough landmarks for me to know. Wait, this is the exit. I just had to keep having faith. Oh, thank goodness. It looked the same. It looked samey earlier, so I wonder, worried if I did it wrong. It worked, chat. Oh, well, thank God we're out of there because that place was kind of boring. Oh, hey, this music. Hope this version don't get claimed. I actually managed it really fast. People tend to take a lot longer there. Well, I guess this is where we part ways. Don't have a name, but remember me sometimes as being a pretty cool guy, okay? Who are you? Yeah. This music is in Mother 1 and 2 as well. Whoa, that snowman's looking kind of yellow. Did someone piss on him? Welcome. I am surprised anyone would come to such a cold place. Okay. Oh! Oh, hello, Purple Yeti. Whoa! A 10 Yeti? And Oh, is it? It's a play on 1080 because he's doing a snowboarding move? Okay, I get it. I'm assuming he's weak to fire. Like every ice enemy in existence. Let's smell him to be sure. 
Weak against fire, weak against crying. Okay, we hit him with that. Do this. Yeah, set him on fire. 633. Yeah, we'll take a level up. Ice dog. Whoa, chili dog. Oh, I get it. I get it. Ha 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 ha. Very funny. I wonder if he's weak to fire, chat. Excellent. There we go. 505. Secret herb. Double jerky. Let's do this then. Come on. Actually, I don't really need PK fire. Normal attacks on everybody should be more than enough, I think. Oh wait, no, Kumbator got to act first, never mind. Bust your check, don't mind if I do. That's a lot of XP for taking out a simple dog enemy. Let me see here. One of those on Lucas to play it safe. Snowboard and Yetis are back. What are those, like, blue lips or something? I think so. Okay, there we go. Swung its plank of wood. Yeah, smash attack. Kumatora leveled up. Okay, she's just about catching up with the boys here. Okay, a little bit of everything on that one. It's pretty good. These guys are giving good stuff, so we should deal with them. I'll go ahead and... Oh, right, I got PK Teddy Beta. Let's try it. And try this. This should be enough. Called for help. Kind of wanted to get go through with that. Sent fleas flying. Ew. Blast him with that teddy bear love. Okay, there we go. One, one, three, eight. Lydia is a very kind person. We snowmen like Lydia. Okay. What about, what's down here? Presents. Cancer bracelet. I know it's the astrological sign. It just doesn't sound right. You know what I mean? Uh, yeah, she she's the mage. She probably needs this the most. So we'll let her wear it. Besides, the one I got on Lucas buffs his offense. She doesn't need that one. Let's fight him. Okay. PK Teddy Blast. PK Fire. These two attacks should be enough. Provided she doesn't get solid. Kumatora use PK uh, Fire. Nice. 10 10. Let me take a look at the gains here. Uh, wrong one. Status. 3,000, 3,000, just under 3,000. About equaled out. Let's take them both out. We can do it. They might be radical yetis, but we got the power of teddies. Let's do it. Alright, nine hits. Good damage. Ooh. Ooh. Engulfed in flames. Damn it, that should have killed. Damn it. 
really underestimated how much health it had left. Yay. Um, I should have some goods to use up here. We Oh, wait, the nuts. That's right. 5 HP. These are just eating up space. <laughs> yeah. Sorry to say it, Salsa, but these aren't that great. Double jerky, 160 HP. Just let Lucas eat it. Peculiar cheese? Forgot about that. Uh, do you like cheese? She isn't too fond of cheese. Damn it. Yogurt? May as well use this up. It's kind of a mit, like, uh, not that great of an item anyway. Hot spring egg, 100 HP. Edible mushroom. I'll let you have that. No problem here. Hello, welcome to Snowcat Mountain. I'm a snowman that Lydia made. Oh, it's you. Hi there, I'm the friendly item deposit guy. How can I help you? Do I have anything I don't really want right now other than... Yeah, there's the mementos. I don't know, though. I think I should hang on to those. Luxury banana, Dory's memento. What about you? Finally use this guy a little bit, I guess. Nope, keep that. Cheek gloves, you don't need this no more. I don't feel like selling it later, just in case. Pamphlet. Eh, never using this. That'll do for now. Gods are watching over you guys. You're incredible, you're amazing. Seriously, you're a real inspiration. We're right behind you, supporting you 100% from the sidelines. Thank you, item guy. From the moment they're made, snowmen wait for someone. Some snowmen melt away without ever meeting anyone. You need something? Make a save. 15 hours. 15 hours, and this is only like, what, part 5, I think? Yeah. I feel like a lot happens in each episode now, for sure. Yes, please. I'm a mole cricket. I followed you here. I'm studying, you see. I have an undying sense of curiosity. It's like the call of the wild and all that. For whatever reason, I picked up all sorts of stuff along the way. Please let me use them to conduct business. Sure. We got, ooh. Warm sweater? Strong against ice. I have better stuff, though. Um. Bear hat? We need that. White ribbon, cancer bracelet, double jerky, flea powder, secret herb. We definitely want the, the hat. No, the white ribbon would be good for both the dog and Kumatora. Thank you. I'm still new to this. Your work is my can. Oh, wait, no, he disappeared. Ah, oh, hang on. Is he still there? Okay, he's right there. Let me get my money out. Yes. DP stuff. Just take out a bunch for a second. Bear hat, bear hat, bear hat. Okay, let's do it. Bony. Bear hat, yes. Equip the bear hat, yes. Sell the cow hat, sure. Okay. Wait, it's also good for Lucas. Let Lucas buy it. Equip the bear hat. Yes. Yes. White ribbon. Okay, the bear, it's either ribbon or that, so white ribbon for Kumatora. Yes. What about the charm? Hang on a second, let me just make sure of something here. The charm goes on to, yeah, body. Souvenir tress is this. Um, do I really need this anymore? I feel like it only restores one hit point each time. I feel like this has kind of outlived its usefulness. I feel like I was getting more HP earlier on. I thought this might be better. It's not really like leftovers anymore. I don't know if I should sell it though. Maybe I'll, di I'll just ditch it with the item guy. Cause I feel like it's rare. Bye, Lucas. Get a warm sweater. Wait, strong against ice. That is a better thing to have right now, but 
The charm goes on the body anyway. Yes. Okay, Bantam Charm. Defense 15. Kumatora needs this, yeah. Yes. And that's everything, right? Stores 100 HP. Give me one of those for the hell of it. Alright. I'm gonna just give you the sweater. Where is it? Where is it? The knit sweater. You know, I never use the damn bug spray. Just take it. Now let me put my rest of my money away. Everyone just got some significant stack gains from that stuff. Yes, I do need something. Let's make a quick little save here. Okay. Put my money away. Boy, I'm withdrawing. What the hell am I doing? Alright, no money's on me. Good. Yo, what's up? Bunnies! Oh, dear me! My little bunnies have run off! This is quite a surprise. We haven't had visitors in some so in some time. You must be cold. Come inside and warm up. Door. Everything is great. Yo, pig mask guy. Lydia's prized fluffy bed. So you're the one they call Lucas. I've heard about you from Iona. They say you're the one who can pull the needles. Such a strong, sweet face. I'm Lydia, the frog person of the Snowcat Mountain. What you seek is behind this house. It's surreal, realizing the time has finally come for my needle to be pulled. I never thought the day would come to pass. When you pull the needle, I'll vanish. That is our fate as the frog people, so that is what must happen. When the time comes, I will welcome it with open arms. But there is one concern I have. Who will take care of my precious bunnies once I'm gone? No one will be here to look after them. And then there's him. He still hasn't regained his strength yet. I hope everything works out for the best when the time comes. We aren't permitted to interfere, and it's wrong of me to worry so much about it. I'm a mess, a horrible frog person. I never believed the time would come. Lucas, pull the needle, because it's time. All right, then. Poor little bunnies. I'm sure they'll be okay. Now then, have faith. The time has come, and go pull the needle. I've unlocked the door. Hold up, though. I've got space. Making sure of that this time. Uh-oh. What is that? Is that what it sounds like when the time comes? Uh-oh. No problem here. Are we sure about that? I guess I can't talk to them. Uh-oh. This isn't good. Something's getting vaporized over there. Oh, goody! We're all just gonna die, apparently. Maybe we should move? Now things are purple. And blue. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Maybe we could go over and look now? Or are we just gonna sit here? Hey, it's you! That person that's capable of pulling the needles. 
Oh, I get mistaken for looking like. Who could you possibly be? Aye. That is a berserk looking gorilla. Well, you got a jetpack? I like your shorts. Where'd you get them? All right, then, here we go. Steel Mech Gorilla suddenly attacked. Well, then. Bring it on. Did I use the. St I don't think I used the, um, the hot spring before moving on. Oops. Well, then. Let's just wing it, everybody. Defense up, everybody. Okay. Let's go ahead and lower its offense and have Boney sniff it. Hang on, it's not too loud, is it? It's weak against the lightning. Okay, we can deal with that. Smells like it's weak to crying. I don't even remember what inflicts crying anymore. Good defense gains. Good de 32 decrease, nice. Damn, that still hits pretty hard though. Let's make sure we abuse this as much as we can then. Okay. Flash does crying, did it? I thought it did nothing. Or sorry, did something else I should say. Okay, defense increased. Oh. Now it's getting crits, huh? All right, one more defense increase. One more offense decrease. And for the hell of it, pork stew for Lucas. Hell yeah, stew. All right. We got three defense buffs and three minus buffs on you, buddy. Man, damn, it's crit did nothing now. Okay. Recovery. Hmm. Try a flash on him. Let's try PK Thunder against him. Okay, a little bit of damage there. Couldn't stop crying. He found out the Donkey Kong Country cartoon got cancelled. Now he's upset. Okay. Run that PP for Lucas, but this is fine. So what we're gonna do now... We're gonna lower your defense now. Damn, I can't get the rhythm there. Decrease by 13. Missed. Since we can't spam lightning on it forever, we can sure as hell spend our, all our PP on buffs and debuffs and make sure we just ruin his day as we poke him. Okay, last debuff, and we're good. Let's do it. Increase by 7. Okay. I can use my remaining stuff now on a PK Thunder. I can only do one more, though. So, yeah, let's do it. Nice. Damn, he can't even hit me. Nice. I can't do another flash without my tarts, though, so it's fine. Got one. Okay, that does nothing. Hang on, do I have enough for a life? I do. I'm gonna use it on Kumatora. And her pocket, she's got... I don't think we need to use the tarts here at all. The dumplings can save those. How's it going, Kuna? Welcome. Just in time for Super Mecha Monkey Battle. Yay. Damn it. I'm having trouble getting always getting the second beat there.
Damn it. Okay, there we go. Little bit of damage right there, it's fine. Okay, we win. That wasn't so bad. You win! Th that's a lot of XP. Nice. 33. Hang on a second. If you hit him with- if you actually hit him with PK Thunder, he malfunctions and he becomes much harder. Really? So you're telling me my- my accidental strategy where I forgot to heal before ended up making it much easier. <laughs> That's really funny. I knew that. No, I, I, I had no idea. It, it turns into a berserk gorilla. Dang. Ask failed successfully. I hit him with two thunders though, I'm pretty sure. I didn't see that happen. That masked man, could he be the one pulling the needles? Is Lydia all right? These snowmen are mere memories of a single snowfall and nothing more. Pay me no mind. Damn, that's kind of depressing. This little smoking pile of mud looks like the cookies I baked yesterday. Some sort of waste product. Some sort of incredible power seems to be sleeping here. You're fading. Oh, you can hit him twice with thunder safely, then all his attacks become high damage to everyone. Damn. <laughs> Lucas, someone other than you has pulled the needle. Whatever is inside that person's heart has been passed on to the dark dragon. You must pull the rest of the remaining needles from here on out. Well then. Before I disappear, take this memento of me. Take good care of it. Receive Lydia's memento. Lucas? This is it. The time has come. Believe in that and keep pushing forward. This is where I say farewell. Don't worry about me. You can use the white box at the top of this mountain to leave. Also, go and ask my little pig mask friend what he wants to do now. There they go. Bye bye. Send, send hugs and kisses to the next frog person for me. Who are you? Took your mask off. Hey, wait a second. I secretly listened in on your conversation. Me and you are enemies. Don't bother with me. Just go do what you need to do. I have no intention of helping you guys out. That frog person helped me out, though, even though I'm a complete stranger. So I'm gonna stay here and look after his rabbits. Then we'll be even. Get going already, before another needle gets pulled. Get going already. Wasn't this a guy in Tazmilly? Hold it right there. Don't run around inside, you dummy. It'd be no laughing matter if you stepped on a bunny. Alright, no, he won't let me run. Does look like Apple Kid as well. I don't think it's Apple Kid, though. Alright, bunnies are now safe. Leave Snowcat Mountain. Hold up. White box. Oh, it's a slide. I see. All right, let's go. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Yeah, let's go. Going for a little slide, everybody. Have I heard this track in Earthbound? Is this the track that plays when you're on, like, the bus? Showing you that the people you've met... Uh, your enemies are still human. Yeah, I guess that does what that does. It's the Skyrunner theme. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Oh, that's what we got. 
Skyrunner, okay. The funky thing Jeff wrote to save Ness and Paula. Whoa! What is that? What are we in, a fridge? Are we pulling an Indiana Jones here? It was actually a fridge. Oh my god. I was joking. What, did, did this come out before or after that movie? Genuine question. For some reason, Kumatora started to feel feverish. It was before. Really? Really? Two years before Indiana Jones 4. Okay. Oh, all right. Nobody gets to run. This is the white metal box you rode here from Snowcat Mountain. Now I saw this... But I don't know where the hell this leads. Or rather, I found the second one, but it didn't... The se did the second one tell me where to go? I'll double check it. Was Indiana Jones a... a, a yeah. A fan of Earthbound or Mother 3? Perhaps. What did this one say? Wait a second, the table's got the ribbon on it. I didn't notice that before. Let me double check this. Attacked... Very bad. Come to Thunder area. Thanks. Yeah. All right. I just assumed this was a table. I didn't even notice the shape or the bow, in all honesty. I thought it was telling me to go forward down the hall. Well then. Oh! Okay, listen. Okay, listen. Listen, listen, I know people are going to be a little huffy and puffy about me being in this section earlier. How was I supposed to know that, that you get on the table and it, like, gallops like a horse? My fever went away. Counter Alpha. This is the thing Lucas rides in his smash entrance. You're totally right. Alright, we got more stuff. It just looked like a table to me. I wasn't even looking at it that much. Made it easy to get rid of my, uh, fever, at least. Oh, there's a mouse. Either way, I wouldn't have wanted to done this earlier, because I would have wanted more party members. Squeak, squeak. Thank you for taking the time to read. We were reading stuff is hard. Squeak, squeak. What, my mom's calling for me? Okay, I'll head back. Thank you, time for read the sign. This sign loves you. That's not true. Nobody loves me. <laughs> it's a lie, chat. Where are we at? Let me make sure I get everything. Let's look for the mice. How many did I find last time? Like one or two? I know it wasn't much. What's this? No problem here. What about Teddy? Teddy loves me. Teddy always will love me. And we love Teddy's here. Get on the coffee table. Guess I didn't need to worry about fighting these things. What the hell is that? Well, it's gone now. Let's just make sure we check the area for mice. Anything down here? No mice, it seems. This is behind this. No problem here. Nothing there. Where are we at? That was a rare enemy in there, was it? Is it just like actually supposed to be a super rare spawn? That golden thing? Damn, now I want to fight it. Well, I don't see it now. Damn it. There's no need for redeems. I should always be hugging a teddy. That's right. Chat, if in the future I'm in a relationship and they make me choose between them or the teddy, they're not going to win. Ideally, we wouldn't even be in a relationship unless they accept Teddy as well. They have to like Teddy's. It's mandatory. Well, it's not showing up again. So let's look around here. 
There's one. There we go. Stop. Come here, you. Squeak, there was an accident here. I saw it with my own eyes. It's scary. The world's become so scary. What, my mom's calling for me? She's even scarier than the world when she wants to be. I better go home. Can we appear anywhere in the tunnels? Oh. Let's try checking out these quadrants. He's passed out. All right, good for him. We're on a bridge right now. I can't go down there. This is one wild and wacky table. Let's see if the mouse is outside here. Oh, there is one. I hate this stupid old factory. There's nothing to eat here. My mom's calling for me. Better get back before she gets real mad. Let me see. The old quote of, husband made me pick between him and the cat, and sometimes I miss him. <laughs> That's a thing. Now, chat, I don't need to... Yeah, blah. I don't mean to sound like I have any idea what I'm talking about, but... If someone gives you, like, an ultimatum... In a relationship like that, I feel like that's just like an instant deal breaker for me. Let's see here. Like, it doesn't matter what what it even is. It's just the fact that you're given an ultimatum period is kind of just like not cool. All right. Takes a while for me to load getting off. Let's look around here. I don't see no mouse this way. What about up over here? Oh, that thing bumped itself. Oh, there's you. Hang on. Squeak, thanks for your help. My ch children have started to return. Thank you so much. E two more mice are still missing. If you see them, tell them to come back. Please let me know. Please, please, please. Squeak, hey dude. It's me, the Squeaks. The hip chick magnet you met by the pond. But now I'm a stay-at-home daddy-o. Squeak, I'm not really sure what happened, but my hubby finally came back home. Between you and me, I think his old self might have had more charm. Ho oh. ho. Alright, let's keep looking for the other mice then. There's two more. Look around over here. Just check everywhere that's off-road. What's this? Hang on. I mean, obviously, yeah, there's always going to be exceptions. It's There could be, like, a lot of different situations. But if it's something stupid like... Like, your partner's like, oh, it's either your your family or me. It's like, it, it, not them. Never. Never go along with those games, chat. Have some self-respect. Get on the coffee table. All right, let's check the other quadrants or whatever you want to call them. Let's go up over here. Nothing up over here. Let's get off here and take a look. May as well stop at the save frog for now. The highway. You say anything different? I sell dangerous stuff. Oh yeah, it's this guy. Nah. You look familiar somehow. Oh, there's one. Okay, one more. Next time I get reward, I want to be a sperm whale. Okay, eat giant squids and stuff. My mom's calling for me. There's no time for me to be dreaming. All right, later, buddy. Boop, boop, uh. Part of the reason you dumped your ex is because he would not stop talking about uh, one thing, D&D. &D. Happy he was enjoying it, even helped him bounce uh, bounce ideas off him. But it was just 95% of her conversations. Yeah, fair enough. You see. You gotta... If someone just talked about one thing and one thing only, and I had no interest in it, there was only so much, right? There's only so much and... Oh, okay, hang on. Conflict of interest then, yeah. Squeak, squeak. Guess what, guess what? Whenever I eat a cookie and munch on it, my cheeks get all big and chubby. 
It's funny when they get like that. My mom? Oh, she's smiley again today. Let's smiley whenever me and her are together. Let's go home now. All right, let's do this. Let's get on the thing. Excellent. Perfect. Let me go over here. This will be another quick way to get to the mouse. Gallop all the way to the end. Oh, yeah, for sure. That's definitely, like, a different thing. For sure. Like, being supportive of uh, your partner's hobbies is one thing. But if, like, if that's literally the only thing ever forever they will talk about and they know you don't care about it, like... You're not gonna be- you're not gonna last long if you don't like- like- yeah. I don't know how to choose the right words for this, but you know what I mean, right? You know what I mean. Squeak. Thank you so much. Thanks to you, my children have returned home with cheerful smiles. For being so kind, I'll give you two things to token appreciation. First is a kiss from me. Ew, you got germs on you. You're a mouse. Other thing is this. A shield snatcher. You felt something warm inside your heart. A shield snatcher. Let me check that. What is it? Oh, it's a little it's a little goo gooey stick. It steals their enemy shield away. That's great. Yay. Speaking of differences in couples, here's the mice couple. And this thing is reusable, right? Anyways, now that we've done this, I guess... Hang on a second. Thunder area... Thunder the tower. Hang on, let's go to the tower. Let's see what that's about. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Perfect, let's go this way. That was a rhino thing. There's a scrapyard. Let me see. You would only talk about the hobbies while uh, you were dealing with things like um, your cat dying. Yeah, see, that's another that that's another thing. That's more so more context, for sure. Um, do I need to get off this? I think I do. Plenty of bosses used and start the battle with shields, so it's a good item. Yeah, for sure. No one's inside the Thunder Tower at this time. Sneaking in is even more unallowed. As are peeking, leaking, and reeking. Damn it, I can't do it then? That sucks. Oh, you'd have to be sorry. It's fine. I opened the conversation. What about over here? Where's this go? Hang on. Was I not allowed to ride the table this way? It wasn't, right? Get on the coffee table. Yeah, I can go in here after all. It's just the blockades you can't go through. Where does this go? If I'm not allowed in the Thunder Tower, then... I got no map for this place. I don't even remember what this is or if I've been over here. There's these enemies here. Filthy attack roach. Seems like they're enemies that are tough for this part. Ah, damn it. Okay, then. I should probably heal after this, then. Naughty mushroom attacks. Getting a warm, fuzzy feeling in your heart is a uh, reference to a scrap mechanic. Oh, is that what it is? Was kindness supposed to be like a stat? I think I remember someone saying at one point. Man, I really need to heal. <laughs> My, um... I don't have any, P any PSI anymore. Yeah, we'll do that. It'll have to do for now. Oh! Uh, watching ceiling... 
Tears overflow. Tears overflow. Oh, come on. That's not the back. Garbage. It's not scrapped. It's a secret stat. It sort of still exists. Okay. Has some uses, but very minor. There we go. This is the first time I'm seeing a Mr. Saturn in the game right in this game, right? Come on. How much are they giving? 972. Okay, I am supposed to be here right now. That's that's a, that's accurate XP. Wait. Is this the Mr. Saturn village? This is Saturn Valley. Don't make me explain any more than that. I'm not even really sure what the deal with this place is. There's a frog there. Uh, an indescribable smell lingers in the air. There's a frog. Save your game. Save, why don't I? Please be careful. Give my regards. Talk? We've taken control of this nonsensical village. The place is nonsensical, but it doesn't change the fact we're great and almighty. Boing. Oops, I think this village is starting to get to me. You weakling, stinkling Mr. Saturns. Don't force us to use this fright bot to make you cry. Enough of your stupid nonsense. Tell us where the needle is or we'll make it, uh, make it tell you scarier stories. Okay, the needle is here. I'm supposed to do this. I thought this would be like a side quest or something. Okay, let's get started. This is gonna be scary, so listen good. Oh, non Mr. Saturns. What are you doing here? We'll beat you good. I, I need to heal still? Oh, great. Fantastic. Yeah, I guess we're mashing buttons for a little bit here. The fright bot told a pants wedding scary story. Did nothing. Pepper spray. I can't stop crying. Pig mask captain fired a beam. Missed. Nope, nope. We're gonna attack that one first. Told a scary, so, uh, so scary you'll never go to the bathroom at night again. You can't stop me from going to the bathroom. I don't care how scary your story is. I'm not pissing my, I'm not pissing myself <laughs> in my bed. Oops, wrong thing. Get him. The fright bot told a scary with some deeply touching moments mixed in. Fire to pepper spray. Bony's almost dead. If only I could have healed before knowing I was walking into a goddamn boss fight. Okay, one's down. Ugh, this is fantastic. Can I, like, run? Couldn't run. No. At this point, I might as well just let them kill me. Not like I have any money to lose. I have no freaking PP. I already, already used it all. I was hoping I could just walk in and just heal somewhere. Accidentally told a cute funny story. Run. That run even works in this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oops. Hit the speed up. Wait, this thing can't even damage? Come on. Come on, finish me off, buddy. No, I hit the Fright Bot again. The Fright Bot doesn't do anything. Bump, bump, bump.
Any day now. I've been waiting to take mortal damage for a little bit here. What? I didn't want that to happen! Ah! I just wanted to get out of here! Fine! Then we'll kill them. When was my last save? Can I just go back to that? Um, I'm going back to my last save. I'm not wasting my time on this anymore. Come on. Come on! <laughs> yes, yes, yes. It was at Saturn Valley. It was right outside. I forgot there was a frog there. What about this one? That's a fright bot. Is this a spring? Is a spring over here? This hole and cl to cliff and fire mountain. Yeah, I want I, I want a spring. Black collar. Well, that's good. Oops. Wait, what? Oh, God damn it. I hate how you have to hold the right... The right person has to be holding it for this to work. Ooh, nice. Give it to Boney. I probably should give all the mementos to the item guy and save them for, like, the end of the game. If this is how they work. Go to Boney, please. Alright, that's good. Put that on. Oh, the hot spring is upstairs. Hang on. We just look for a way up. No problem here. Only five and ladder. I just want a hot spring. Please, I just want the hot spring. Oh, finally. <laughs> Why the hell do they have to make that so annoying? Uh. All right. Everyone feels alive again. Hold that, hold that thought. Now let me get this. Couple life noodles. Let's just go down. Go down and get back to the other guy. Make a save again after doing that. We get some water. Save the game. And hang on. I set the water bottle down so I could press left on this. All right, game saved. Now let's just obliterate these boys. Enough of your stupid nonsense. Let's get started. Okay. Now let's go ahead and just spam PK Teddy since we can instantly go heal after this. Now we're full power, baby. Getting destroyed. Oh, the blood curling story. It said some nasty, horrible things. Why would you do that? That's so mean. Fired pepper spray. Oh, give me a damn break. Nice. Now we should be able to just beat this last guy. Easy. Accidentally told a cute funny story. There we go. Totally scrapped. It's scaring the teddy bears. We gotta destroy it. That's that's a lot of XP for those guys. All I needed was a little bit of PP. Thank goodness I am smiling. Ding, I look uh, looking this way. I am happy. Am I in trouble? No, wait. I am happy. Saved. Zoom, zoom. Thank you, thank you. Yes, zoom. No problem here. Alright, that covers that. Make another save? Because why the heck not? Okay, here comes the scary. Ah, non-scaring people. 
This one's alone. Get him. Eleven hits. Come on. He's he's making it so the teddy bears are too scared. This is why freight bots must be destroyed. 360. No sad teddies anymore. Get rid of it. Good kid shirt. Uh, good kid shirt? Who's holding it? IQ plus 10. Hang on a second. Lucas has what equipped? On Okay, that's actually better then. That's the case. We'll go to items. Give this to Boney. Also give this to Boney. Oh wait, gonna give it. It's got the skull on it. Give to Lucas. Yeah, slight increase to everything. Makes you smarter to be a rebel, chat. Once again, the power of goths is, un is unleashed. Sleep at 11. Thank you, doing. Me too, boing. Was scary, but now unscary. Am relieved. Go deal with more of these chumps. Two fright bots. Scariness seems to be wearing off. And sensing limit now. Oh, that was me talking to myself. Did that scare you already? Okay, let's begin. Well, you're scary. We'll stomp you hard. Yay. I'll go ahead and just hit him with the PK Teddy to speed it up. I think fire didn't do much, actually. So let's do this. Told a blood-curling story. Started telling a spine-tingling story. Come on. Come on. They should be dead by now. Come on. Uh, told totally scary with some deeply touching moments mixed in. Any day now. Hang on, is my... I think one of my buttons is stuck. Yes, it is. Um... Controller? Uh-oh. Chat? My controller isn't working, and it's can only accept an A button input right now. Um, what the hell happened? I don't think my keyboard's gonna do anything. I don't even have it mapped. Um, this is a problem. Can I, like, reconnect the controller? That might require a restart, though. Oh, oh, okay, it's working, it's working. Okay, good. I don't know what the hell happened there. Cramped. Ding, ding. Let's get stuff. Strawberry tofu. Give thanks at you? Yes. Give this at you. Bow tie. A silver dragonfly, not a bow tie. K.O. Thanks, thanks. Uh, a fart. Indescribable smell lingers in the air. Saved is good. Ding, ding. All right, then. Who are you? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Get out of here. Get! You lost, kid. Scram. Oh, hey, it's Duster. And the rope snake. Key! 
It's making horrible chalkboard scratching sounds while trying to scale, tell scary stories. Where's the needle? Where in Saturn Valley is it? Do not know. Don't lie. You lied yesterday, too. You better tell us or we'll start tickling your underarms again. Yes, yes. We are no good. Who are you? What do you want? Don't tell me these are the ones. Just get them. Alright, real fight. Let's just spam them with everything we got now, why don't we? Okay, Boney can't really do a whole lot. He did a bum rush. Oh, that did a lot. Tried to strike Lucas's joints! Nine hits. Right bot did nothing. Teddy Blast! Yay. PK Teddy. Making sure Lucas don't die. Come on. Come on! Yeah, yeah, no, no, no! Don't stall. Don't stall. Yeah, that's great. That's great. Heal. Heal. Yo! Come on! Now I gotta reset. I can't lose that. Piss off with that garbage. That was so stupid. Unbelievably stupid. Ah. Uh, why did they have to just frickin' attack Lucas like that? Come on now. Well, Adam guy's not here. He's all the way back to the mountain. He's not here when I frickin' need him. Ugh. Does that mean I gotta fight those ones again? Yeah, it does. What's my health at? For God's sakes, go to status. We're at full. Let's just get this one done if we can. Alright, there we go. Back into the fight. Actually work this time. How about that? Mm-hmm. Kill one of them. Kill him. The fright bot told a wet, eh, pants wetting scary story. Okay, get him. Kumator is getting beat down. Oh, God. Why is it still going down that much? Now I gotta recover her. No! Wrong one. Time bomb stuck to Lucas. Ah. Life up B. Alright, finally, one of them's freaking dead. Kill it. Told a cute, funny story. Finish it off. Oh. Everyone attack the fright bot now because I pressed the A button on it. Alright. Oh. Well, this sucks. Hang on, I'm just gonna reset and not go in there then. That's a bit stupid. <laughs> Come on. There we go. Alright, I'm just gonna leave these guys behind if I don't have to fight them. I'm not wasting all those revives on that. Get PP topped up over here. Wait, no, my hip. My PP was already full, wasn't it? I kind of forgot Duster's in there. Let's go deal with them.
No, no, we have to deal with them because Duster's there. I kind of completely forgot it was just um, that one had Duster and not Mr. Saturn. Oops. There we go. All right, let's try again and not be upset. <sighs> I just don't want to waste these damn revives. There we go, finally. All right. I'm going to try doing this then. Let me see. Freeze beta on you and smell their weakness. I'm being impatient with them. I need to stop it now. Trying to strike Kumatora's joints. Weak against ice, weak against sleep. Boney's going to waste it now, but he's not holding any of them. Didn't work. Okay, one worked. Body turned numb. Okay. Mm. Okay, did that much. I gotta heal. TK freeze. Life up, Boney. Wait, what are you doing? No, don't bash. Freeze him. And you just guard or something. Don't. Okay, good. They didn't just, like, focus on one target this time, so it wasn't silly as hell. How is he not dead? <laughs> Kill him! I am begging you, game. I can't take it anymore. Frightbot's, the Frightbot's text is why I couldn't heal in time last time, too. Alright, now we're nearly done. Just gonna hit this thing a few times. Frightbot told the scary, so you'll never go to the bathroom at night again. Okay, finally. I can breathe a sigh of relief. I don't have to worry about this dumb thing anymore. We leveled up. <laughs> 33. And we get stuff. Boney's level 35. Oh, that frustrated me. Ah, Frightbot! We needed that. We must inform Mr. Facade immediately. You'll pay for this. I'll make sure you pay. Oh, there you are, Duster. Yay! Lucas! Kumatora! Boney! Thank goodness you're alright. The kind people of this valley rescued me, but those other guys captured us all. Don't worry, the Egg of Light is safe. Jeez, is this lucky or unlucky? I can't tell. You're all lucky. That's the only way I can see it. Please to let down. Let's let these guys down for now. Hmm, I see. Needles that seal away the dark dragon, hmm? Sounds like I should go with you. Lucas, I'm coming too. Actually, we would have dragged you along with us anyway. Duster, join the party. Oh, thank fu Finally. Finally. I got my party members back. It only took three hours. Have map give at you. Cool. Uh, this isn't that helpful, not gonna lie. You saved. Pig mask, we're asking about the needle's location. You really don't know where it is? Do know. Do know. No. Do no do do know. They say they know. Does that mean they've met one of the, the frog people? Ding ding! Met. Can go far that way easy. Doing. Boing. Can go. That way means that way. I can tell by their eyes. North. They're saying to go towards the volcano in the north. 
We are... the. Uh, we are catched? Is that what that says? No, that's not C, is it? What the hell letter is that? Lots. We are Mr. Saturn. We always get... Is it catched? It is catched. They mean captured, I think. Always get catched. Uh, barely T. Barley T. There's some things I want to forget and some things I have forgotten. But have you forgotten me? It's me, the Rope Snake. I apologize for the trouble I caused before. No, I'm not depressed. I'm not. Really, I'm not depressed. Till the day comes when I can be useful again, I'll... I'll devote myself to being patient. Not coming with? Alright. Okay, they're kicked out. That's good. So all I had to do was beat that one house. Then, then the houses aren't optional, then. I don't know what the hell that person was saying. I had to save Duster. All right. Now then. Now then. Do not know now then. Okay, now that we've got all that, let me check Duster's stats. He's level 29. Close to another level there. Let's make a save here. Do I need to save something? Yes, I do. Ba -ba -ba -ba. No, 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 it's fine, friend. It's misunderstood you, I guess. Anyways, so I'm assuming you can get Kumatora or Duster in any order, because it seems like there was nothing stopping me from actually going this way the first time. For some reason, Lucas is feverish. Mr. Sathern, smooth, smooth after bath. You go Fire Mountain, zoom, zoom. Up to five peoples. Playing ladder. Okay. Keep looking up here. Girl. Okay. Anyways, let me let me just heal and wash away my frustration. Those guys just did so much damage, and now I'm, I'm mad the item guy isn't here, because I want to give them all these uh, mementos now. Yeah, let's do it. Was he up here the whole goddamn time? Well, that pisses me off more. Just take him. Just take him. There you go. Oh, boy. Shield Snatcher. Hang on to that for now. Sprinting Bomb. Do you have anything like, useless now? No, you've got good stuff, actually. So we'll let you keep these don't need this anymore. You know what? I feel like I can... I doubt I'll have to deal with that enemy again. I'll just deal... I'll just ditch that. There, that'll do it. The gods are watching over you guys. Oh. It, it doesn't matter, chat. We did it. We're done? We did it? Everything is fine. Everything is fine. Everything is fine. Shield Omega. Let's just go this way. Oh, cool. Another fart box. <laughs> Some sections are much tougher with only Lucas and Boney, though. Yeah, this part would have kicked my ass if I didn't have Kumatora. Fire Mountain above Cliff can go. This is probably why they have the mementos, right? Duster needs to, like... Oh, I see. I Hang on. Wall's too solid here for staples. Okay, then. That's the case. Yeah, where do I use it then? This one? Fire Mountain above cliff can go. Itty bitty wait before going up. Oh, I see what they're gonna do. I see, I see. Oh, all right. We're happy and wholesome, chat. We saved the Teddy Village. Well, they're not Teddies, but we saved them. We saved Duster. Everything is cozy. Go up. Go up indeed. Hmm. Just a few more. More will make us fall. K. 
KO, KO. Ooh, bar Ong Barley Tea. Shoe Prince and Face. Boing. Sweating Mr. Saturn. Slippy. Sneeze comes out when nose grappled. He did it! All right, we made it. We don't have to worry about accidentally reviving anymore. It's fine. Fall apart, fun. Yay. All right, we're not going back down, it seems. Let's head on ahead. There's a save frog there, another mole cricket. One of these locations here. Maybe tiny, but we're still living things. Actually, we started to branch out into the business world. With franchises opening up everywhere, we're now at the forefront of business evolution. We have all sorts of wonderful goods that we found lying on the... I mean, stocked up on. I could let you have some of them if you'd like. Would you like to take a look? Yes. Chat, quick question. Uh, it's okay to tell me. Um, should I just save here? Because, um, I'm looking at the time. I actually got to get ready to go out soon. I, I kind of lost... I didn't realize I was already well over three hours, not going to lie. Hmm. Sincerity dumplings, recollection bell. I wanted to go closer to the... Yeah, I was kind of, like, going to stop 20 minutes ago, but I lost track of time. There is a save frog nearby. This seems like a good stopping point, because we just got the whole party back together, and we got lots done. Because I'm, I'm worried with um, one of the frog people here, we're just going to be stuck in a cutscene for a while. Would stop here if I were you. Okay, good to know. Alarm cicada, this is all this stuff. Don't think we need any of these, so it's fine. Okay. I'll make a save here. I think I made really good progress today. Apparently this chapter is super, super long. You are going to be stuck in a cutscene for a while. Okay, then. So we'll come back immediately preparing to read then. As I mentioned earlier, I'm actually going downtown for dinner, and I don't want to run late because I was playing video game. <laughs> That'd be another, that would just be another bad story. Anyways, though. We had a lot of fun. We got lots done. It was nice to do a long session of this again. Again, sorry it took, um... Sorry I didn't get the chance to play any really last week. I had to deal with uh, quite a bit of stuff going on, including a copyright claim in the last episode. But um, I'm hoping I can do multiple sessions of this next week, and we can make even more progress. I was worried about the controller messing everything up. I hope I didn't get too frustrated at the end. I was a little annoyed with that one fight. <laughs> or rather... Not realizing I should have stored all the mementos, but it's okay. All I really missed out on in the end was, like, one extra house of the Frightbot XP. <laughs> it's okay. I don't think this episode should have any claims. It doesn't seem like any of that music played. We should be okay. If you're watching on YouTube, hope this uh, series has still been pretty comfy and cozy. Hope you guys had fun. Have a good night, and bye-bye.